congratulations. You won. It's not like we're not progressing yeah. in this game. I'm just saying that, like, as the subathon goes through, like, I'm just getting more fucked up and it's getting harder yeah. to, like, play new games. Father, So I was doing the right thing, but it's jank. Thank you. 
I try locking on it. Uh, what NPC did I talk to an NPC that told me what to do already? Or should I keep looking? People, t I never would have guessed that because people told me that the fishing was optional. I was told the fishing was optional, so I never would have. I never would have known. Uh,
No problem, man. I'm enjoying it. I like when the timer is not constantly beeping so I can actually enjoy the game. That edging at one second shit earlier was so fucking stupid. I was so annoyed by that. Like, it's just so unnecessary. If you're gonna let it end, let it end. But, like, why let it go to one second? It's just sad, you know. I like it a lot so far. Got to one second twice today. Not just once, but twice. Oh! 
Doesn't it feel good to not have it at one minute?
Maybe we've been on this game for too long. Maybe I just need a break from it. 
tongue thing. It's kind of weird. Is it there? Changes hypercorn. Oh, it's a flash scan. What people actually want a movie? <laughs> yeah, I'm too tired to. Navigate dungeons now. Too tired. Yeah, I've been enjoying it, but I'm tired and hungry. So, give me Mort or give me death. Alright, what games do you guys want on this poll?
Creature GBA loses every pull. It's been on every single pull and it's lost every time. I think it needs a break. Ratchet and Clank, Galaxy. Glover. I, uh, when I was in the toilet, I got the notification that Glover was delivered. So we can do that, but I have to actually go to the mailbox, which, like, requires me putting on my shoes and walking outside. We're gonna need, like, like, at least, like, like, ten minutes on the timer for me to, like, get dressed, go outside, get the package, come inside, open it, get it set up. You know. No, I can go outside in this. I just put like I just like zip up my jacket, it's all good. It's not a big deal. But I have to like you know, I can't I'm not gonna like trip and crack my skull open rushing back to get like it's it's ridiculous, man. Like if I have to rush then it's not gonna last long enough for me to even like play the game anyway. I'll put Glove around the pole, but I, I need time to actually get it. Timer's under a minute. At this point we don't even have time for a pole. Need more time so we can even do a poem. I keep seeing Creature GBA. It never wins the polls. It's the same two people who are dumping points into it. I think it's a bad idea. Alright, so Ratchet and Clank, people keep asking for Sly 2. I'll put that on there as well. I don't know, what else is there? Timer's under 30 seconds. Timer's under 20 seconds. Uh, well if we stare at it, it's not gonna fix itself. Going under 10 seconds. Running out of time. Under 10 seconds. Five. Thank you, false. Congratulations, you Thank won. You even lame. Thanks, Iron. Here are the games we haven't finished yet. B movie. Yeah. Rats. Call of Duty. I'm too tired for that. Crash. Destroy all humans. Donkey Kong 64. Drake and Josh. Ed and Eddie. Frogger, too tired for that. Dark Garfield, God no. Billy and Mandy isn't here yet. Golden Eye, probably too tired for that. Jack and Daxter, I could probably play that. Jaws, fuck that. Jet Set, eh. Jet Fusion, really boring. I don't know, it could be a good meme. Kingdom Hearts, I could maybe do that. Luigi's Mansion, probably could do that. Man vs. Wild, please god no. March of the Penguins, fuck no. <laughs> Mercenaries, eh. Metroid Dread, good, but I probably don't have the patience for it right now, I'm too tired. More the Chicken, please no. Psychonauts, yeah, could probably play that I guess, but timer's always low, it's always edgy when we play that. Ratchet and Clank is good, we could play that. Scooby Doo Cyber Chase could be a good meme. Rugrats on Reptar, probably not. Fairy Tale Freak Town, please no. Sly 2, be fun. Alright, I'm seeing a lot of Crash. Crash Insane Trilogy. Sly 2, Ratchet and Clank, Jack and Daxter. It's always the same three people who say Creature GBA. And like, it never gets in, and the only reason why it ever even gets votes is because the same three people dump points into it. Timer is under 50 seconds. Streamline, I'm gonna hit zero. Tony Hawk could be good.
Thank you, Brick. Yeah. Time is there. Toy Story 2 hasn't been played yet. All right. Well, which games do you think? Which games on that list do you think are a good idea? I see a lot of interest in Crash. Collapse of Doom. Oh my god, man. Luigi's Mansion. Crash. Destroy All Humans. I'll throw a movie on there. Timer's under 50 seconds. <laughs> there is no he, only we. Timer's under 30. I'll put Glob's Doom on there only because I think it's good to have a Spongebob game option. Actually, movie's already on there. Movie's probably more popular. Timer's going under 10 seconds. Are we really doing this every time now? Money! Go away for the 100 bits. 10 more seconds, I'm gonna get interrupted with what I'm saying, and my train of thought's gonna get lost again. Thank Congratulations! You, you won! Yeah, this is crazy. It's so stupid, dude. Like, it's really stupid that people are doing this. Just let it end if you don't want it to fucking continue. It's not enjoyable like this. Just fucking let it end. Let it end, or acknowledge that you're just procrastinating. But this one second shit, like, it's the worst case scenario. It's dead. Yeah, nobody's enjoying this. This is fucking stupid. Under a minute. Did people care? Like, I'm just so fucking annoyed by this, man. It's it's literally like like we're not playing anything. We're trying to, we're trying to figure out what to play. I'm so fucking tired. I can't even like hold my thoughts together because this beeping is just killing my brain cells. Thank you for the point, Jack. Yeah. Walk, lover. I, can, I have time to go outside yeah. and get it. Congratulations, you won. I think that's pretty slow. You won. Lover. Crash Bandicoot. Congratulations, you won. Sorry, I don't know anything about this. Congratulations, you won. Lover, Crash Bandicoot, VFPB. Yeah, I can't give you an interview right yeah. now, man. I'm in the middle of a subathon. Maybe some other time, though. Um, Glover, yeah. Crash Bandicoot, Ratchet, and Clank. I feel like the I feel like the votes gonna get split between Glover and Ratchet and Clank. Congratulations, you won. I feel like Glover, Luigi's Mansion, Crash. Congratulations. You Toy won. Story 2, and then like movie, that that covers a lot of bases there. Congratulations, you won. Lover Crash, Toy Story 2, movie. Congratulations, you won. Yeah, Glover, Congratulations, Crash, you Luigi, won. Toy Story, and movie. I think that'll work best. I can't even remember five items at the same time, dude. I'm dying. Congratulations, you won.
Yeah. Dude, I'll never trust the Nicktoons frogs, man. The Nicktoons frogs are, like, actually just, like... They're always wrong about these games. They're always terrible. Alright, time to vote. They truly do. Like, we played Unite. What else is there? A lot of these games, yeah, this is a pretty good pull. I figured Toy Story might struggle a bit, but yeah. Glover, Crash, and Luigi are probably the only ones that have a chance here. Alright, you got like like a 90 seconds left to vote. It seems like it's gonna be Glover versus Crash. Yeah, this is very, very close. It's back and forth. People have been asking for Toy Story 2 a lot the past few days. Dang dude, this could be any game. Like it's very, very close. I love how like it's just like the like the dynamic of the thing and the, the thing ahead getting complacent and then the other one catches up and the thing ahead gets complacent and the other one catches up. This is like actually like a like a microcosm of the subathon itself. As soon as you get ahead, you're you're out of danger. Like 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 Glover was ahead like multiple times and it's like oh, we're good now. We're ahead and then they lose and it's like oh shit, we're behind now. Like, this is actually just, like, a human nature experiment here. It's so funny, man. Alright, we're playing Crush. I have to actually download the game, though. <laughs> you guys are edging the vote, too. This chat's hindsight is twenty twenty though. Twenty nine gigabytes. Do I even have space for this? Bro.
if you uninstall like Spyro, for example, it saves your data, right? Like, I'm not gonna get fucked if I uninstall the game. Wouldn't be too sure. I'll just install it to my D drive. I'm not gonna have an issue playing this on HDD, right? Like, is it gonna run like shit? The agent. If the loads are bad, that's fine. It's like, whatever. Seventy two hundred. It's taking a while to download. directory for insane trilogy I don't even see one said the Crash Bandicoot. All the people who miss Tubby Custer and don't miss it enough. It's because nobody's paying for it. And that's that. Is it just called Insane Trilogy? I couldn't find it. Yeah, I don't think it has one. I don't know. I bought- I got this in a combo pack a while ago, so I just put it on the list. When we played Spyro Reignited, right?
still downloading. Um, yeah, I mean, like, I get people, like, missing certain games. But, like, Tubby Custard is, like... That's, like, straight up just, like, trolling. Like, that's people give subs to troll the stream with that. Everybody who says they miss it, they would never give a couple of subs for it, because, like, yeah. I've heard bad things about Glover, actually. I've heard terrible things about Glover. Negatron changed me. Dude, if people get, if someone gives me two subs right now, I'll fucking do Tubby Custard. I don't give a shit, but like, they're all talk. They're all talk. Yeah, a lot of people felt that way. Like, I, I actually felt like I was gonna puke playing that game. I think it's almost done downloading. That's nasty. Verifying. I'll, I'll, sh I'll. Five, five hoops for two subs in Arthur. Five hoops. Five shots. We'll figure it out. Thanks for the two gifted. So like, it's like five you shots won. regardless of whether they hit or not. Congratulations, what if we do like, you won. What if we do like every shot? Alright, five shots doesn't have to hit, okay. <laughs> well. This will be interesting. Cage, thank you. Congratulations, you won. Yeah, Mickey Thon begins. Yeah, ten shots.
Big McThankies from McSpankies. Yo, Jay, thank you. W. That's a W. If I've ever seen a W, that's a W. Thank you, man. Oh, it's a code to continue. That's what it is. Yeah, you don't you can't character select. Five shots. <laughs> the biggest brick of all time. <laughs> It's gotta be like one, like five, five shots per sub. That's a lot more fair. All right, there's eleven. Twelve. Yeah, two for ten. Thirteen. Fourteen. Fifteen. Sixteen. Seventeen. The next Lamicky. Eighteen. Nineteen. <laughs> 
Arthur game. <laughs> Alright, every sub I get, I will take five shots. Shit. Thank you, Grand Shine, for the f Congratulations! You won! It's <coughs> one. Congratulations! You won! It's two. Are we 0 30? Yeah! Three. Congratulations! Four. You won! Five. Oh God. Yeah. Six. Congratulations. You won. Seven. Look at all these bricks. What a brick. Eight. There's a ten for ten in chat. If someone donated a hundred, that's five hundred shots. Yeah. Nine. Brick. What the fuck? Oh, somebody threw it back to me. You have to time it. It's weird though. The Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. Someone in chat's counting right. We actually, like, we are building a house. <laughs> Look at all these bricks. I think that's 17. Nineteen. Oh yeah, that's twenty. Twenty-one. Twenty-two. You're right. Ten more. Yeah. Twenty-three. Twenty-seven. Twenty-eight. Twenty-nine. Thirty. This is an absolutely fun day. All right. Every sub I get, I'm, I'm taking five shots. I think there was a 10 for 10 in chat too. Arthur. NBA Jam. Dude, I don't even know what I'm getting myself into, man. <laughs> How
How long does it take to do one shot? Like, it depends if you get it, you like, it's faster, right? So there's incentive to get it first try. There's 10 for 10, yeah. True, that is 100 shots. Yeah, if you overshoot the house, you're losing yeah. time. Thank you, Shulk. One more. Let's shift. Oh shit. Three minutes for that 10 for 10, guys. Take it or leave it. That's 100 shots. 10 for 10 expires in two minutes. Hmm, yeah, that can get me lunch too. That'd be awesome. Five shots per sub, yeah. Every sub is five shots, yeah. It's ten for ten. That's a hundred shots. I'm going to the NBA. <laughs> Dude, this is definitely better than Tubby, though, like... This is, like, wholesome content. In, like, a weird way. Alright, that, that 10 for 10 expires in one minute, man. He's getting lunch in a minute. I want lunch. We all want to eat and sleep. Uh, 100 Lemickeys <laughs> on the line here. And either way, every cell been doing five. We're just helping Arthur fulfill his dream of joining the NBA. Time's running out. Thank you, Brendan, for the five. All right. That's 25 shots. One. Two. Three. Five more subs. Yeah, five more and we get an additional ten. You won. Four. Congratulations. You won. Five. Congratulations. You won. Six. Congratulations, you won. Seven. Eight. Nine. Dang, I'm correct. Ten. Eleven. Thank you have for the four. One more. Twelve. Congratulations, you won. Thirteen. Brick. Congratulations, you won. One for ten in chat right now. Fifteen. Congratulations, you won. Yeah. Thank you, Heavy. That's 10 for 10. Congratulations, you won. Might be a little late, but yeah. Exactly. That was a fucking brick. Thank you, Manic. 
21. Yeah. All right. I gotta do 79 more of these. Yeah. 78. Congratulations. You won. 77. Yeah. Seventy six. Seventy five. Yeah. Seventy four. Yeah. Seventy three. Congratulations. You won. Seventy two. Congratulations. You won. 71. Congratulations, you won. 70. Congratulations, you won. 69. 68. 67. Sixty-six. Sixty-five. Sixty-four. Sixty-three. Arthur Gate. Sixty-two. Sixty-one. Sixty. What a brick. Fifty-nine. Fifty-eight. Fifty-seven. Fifty six, fifty five, fifty four, fifty three, fifty two, fifty one. Fifty. Forty-nine. Forty-eight. Forty-seven. Forty-six. That's Francine, not DWM. 35. 34. This is not Jimmy level, how dare you. 
33. Heh. <laughs> the Mickey Dunk. 32. What a brick. 30. 29. 28. 27. Twenty-five. Twenty-four. Twenty-three. Mickey. Alright. <laughs> Alright. So, I actually want to go eat. But, if we get subs while I'm not here, I'll, I'll do all the, I'll do all the shots for all the subs we get. Okay? Yeah, I'll, I'll do them. I'll do all of them. When I get back. If, if people sub but I gotta go eat it's been a while it's been like 12 hours
Any more bricks I gotta throw up? Doesn't look like it. Right, well, I'm still willing to throw out five bricks per sub, but if not, we can just start Crash Bandicoot. How's that sound? What do we do? I mean, this shit allowed me to eat, so yeah. Yeah, TTS counts as a toss, yeah. Five tosses per TTS. The toss. Yeah, I'll do that. Uh, guy's just being an idiot. Okay. MLB, you mean NBA? Yes, this is this is my favorite baseball simulator. All right, if we're if we're getting a text to speech, I'll stay on this for a couple more minutes. But yeah. Alright. What, the whole subathon or this meme? We, d we did like 150 tosses earlier. But, yeah, apparently we're getting more. Thank you, Luna. Yeah. Wow, that was a fucking brick. That was a brick if I've ever seen one. Thanks for the 500. Whoa! I didn't know Lefron James streamed his practice rounds on Twitch.tv. Literal chills. Whoa! I hecking love watching you throw up bricks on the garage door. Wozers, I love spending thousands of dollars every year to watch you break every game. Chills. I'm actually bricking every shot. I think that was like five. Six. Seven. Wow, that's still too much. Eight. Nine. Ten. Literally didn't make a single shot. Well, the brick. Alright, if we're done with this, we'll, we'll switch over. If not, yeah. Five for every sub. If not, Crash Bandicoot time. I'll give it like 30 seconds. Was that 30 seconds? 
Yeah, it was definitely 30 seconds, all right. I wanted to watch uh, Crash. That was the idea. Right. A boat. A boat? What do you mean? Don't think so. Activision presents a smashing blast from the past. What's up with the resolution? Developed by Vicarious Visions. It's Crash Bandicoot. <laughs> Dude, is this a known bug? Like, the screen is so big that I can't fucking click on anything. Dude, what the hell? I literally can't play the game. Why is it in window mode? This can't be normal. Like, why is it running in windowed? Still broken. Okay, wait, there it goes. Now I have no control. Okay, this fucked up my entire desktop, cool. Great.
Activision presents a smashing blast from the past. Developed by Vicarious Visions. It's Crash Bandicoot! Dr. Cortex, we haven't determined the cause of past failures. <laughs> Moron! This bandicoot will be my general, and he will lead my Cortex commandos to world domination. This time, I shall reign triumphant. <laughs> we are closer than ever before. Quickly, into the vortex! 
Dr. Cortex, the Vortex is not ready. We have no idea what it could do. <laughs> it seems solid. Failure again. <laughs> Capture him. Prepare the female bandicoot. Oh, that wasn't a bandicoot thing, you get extra life when you, yeah, it's like the, that's where Spyro got the, not Spyro, the Sly, got the horseshoe part. Press the jump button, but nothing happened. Oh so you can't run on those, all right. Yeah, eventually we'll play the OGs probably. This is just the one that I own because I bought Spyro a while ago. Crash 4 was fun. I liked it. I thought it was pretty good. I don't think I did, no. Unreal Engine 3 or 4. Four. This game looks alright. I 
edging territory. Is it, is it pretty faithful to the art style of the original? That's nice. You think they gave the skin the rehydrated treatment? They re they, re they rehydrated. I, th I think that they they gave the, the original games the rehydrated treatment. Just they gave it a, they gave it a good remake. I wish that they'd rehydrate the movie again. The studio that did this actually also did BFPB Game Boy Advance, believe it or not. Going under a minute and thirty seconds. Yeah, I was trying to play it like Mario, but clearly we shouldn't. Under one minute. Stream ends and the timer hits zero. Subs, bits, and donations add time. Under 40 seconds. Thirty seconds. Under twenty seconds. Congratulations, nice cat. you won. Thank you much for five. You won. Yeah, fuck edging, man. Yeah, fuck edging. Congratulations, you won. Yeah. Did I miss something? Oh. Congratulations, you won. Well, I haven't slept a full night sleeping. I can't even remember, so yeah. I think I'm handling it better than most people would.
Is there like is it like taboo to miss boxes or something? Why do we need the boxes? I'm doing- I'm hanging in there, man. What's up? Boxes and the bonus levels count. Dang.
a little confusing because up to this point I've only had to like hit him. Like no one. Timer hits zero. Shit. Going under thirty seconds. I think you guys just like it when I say it. Like when I when I say going under thirty seconds, I think it just makes people to hear my voice say that line. Under twenty seconds. That from the like Thanks for the bits, I think. What do we got? Yeah. Thanks, Hanus, for five gifted. Congratulations, you won. that a lot harder than it had to be. My sister said you sounded sexy. So keep doing. Thanks, man. I'll keep doing. I'll oven the food hot out cold. Not supposed to be able to do that, but all right. Shit. What we got? My grandpa just came to the sound of your voice. Is he stupid? I looked away for like one second and I died.
Dang, I suck. Been playing them. My first crap, like crash game, was a um, four. I missed that many. Okay. Hog. Hydrated treatment. The treatment. Hydrate treatment, and my voice wasn't synced to my lips. My skin was very saturated. I can't, I can't blink. My lips aren't synced with my words. Do the characters really not blink? It's so uncanny. probably fun like what year did this game come out is this like fucking 94 or some shit 96 okay eh. it's all right under 40 seconds Twenty, yeah, sixty-four was ahead of its time. Or just like the st the golden standard at the time. Thank yeah. you much for the gift. I mean, Spyro is probably better than this. You know? Like Spyro one. Spyro 1 is solid. Fuck. I 
mean, what do you mean by filters? Like, do you think the game's hard? I think it's a little boring compared to Spyro. Yeah, true. The gameplay does feel like it's aged a bit. Under 30 seconds. Yeah, I mean, like, that's like 64, though. 64 doesn't have that good of bosses either. Under 14 seconds, stream's about to end. 10 seconds, thanks for the 100 bits. Money. That's not enough to save it. In 10 seconds, we'll be having the same conversation. Yeah. Thank you much. Dude, that reminds you of Sunshine. If you have like valid criticisms of the game, people are just like, you're just mad because it's too hard for you. But they couldn't say that during my playthrough because I wasn't dying very much often. It's always the, the primary defense of games that are like a little bit old. Like, you're struggling, but they're just like clearly coping. Okay, this, is, this is like fine. It's not that it's bad, it's just like, you know. Like whatever. As a remake, it seems faithful. Under one minute again. like this like under a minute shit like it was funny for like a few weeks but money kind of getting tired of it now thanks for the hundred bits we're still under a minute we're under 30 seconds even the 100 bits guy hey without him we wouldn't still be here under 20 seconds. Thanks, boss. Thank you, Ghoulie. Wow, these aren't processing. It's gonna end. Congratulations. Nice, like, you won. How many times do I have to say it, man? We need oil. Then we need to not wait for 10 seconds. Why not why not do it at 30 seconds? Why does it have to be 10 seconds? This is why I said this yeah. is fucking stupid earlier, man. Like, clearly you guys are waiting for, like, the last possible second. Like, if you want it to end, you want it to end. But clearly you're just waiting for, like, the absolute possible last second. If you do it at 30 seconds, what's the what's the difference? You guys are stupid. Like, if you just, if you want it to end, let it end. But, like, you're legit waiting for it to, to get to the point where your subs aren't even gonna count. You're waste you're wasting money. Like, you're giving it without even enough time for it to even, like, give subs to people on the website. It took, like, 10 seconds to give those subs to people. Like, it's crazy. Just, like, if you're, like, waiting for the last second, just why not 30 seconds? Or 20, even. This, this like, one second edging is fucking crazy, dude. Cause I don't want to hear it, like, I don't want to fucking hear it the day after this ends, like, I wasn't ready for it to end. Like, I don't know, man, like, what what more can I do? I've, I've warned you about all the pitfalls, like, a thousand times. I think some people like the beeping. I'm like convinced at this point that like the beeping gives them comfort.
I barely missed that checkpoint, huh? Bullshit. Yeah, the beeping is there to get people's attention. Just so there's no like, oh, I would have given subs if I knew it was about to end. Like, you know it's about to end, but it doesn't work very well when people are just never letting it go over a minute. That's just crazy, dude. You guys have all the tools you need to not let this end if you don't want it to end. So like, what's with the fucking edging? If you want it to end, that's one thing, but like, it's so whack. It's, it's such a stupid strategy. It's legitimately a stupid strategy if you want it to keep going. Like, waiting for the, the literal final second is like the dumbest fucking thing I've seen so far this marathon. And it's happened twice. Like, waiting, waiting to like try and get the timer as low as possible is legit just so fucking reckless and dumb. Like, why, why would you wait for the literal final second to give like 100 bits? Instead of just at like five seconds, even like even just like five seconds, like like what are those four seconds doing? Like what what life changing decisions are going through your head in those four seconds? It's just fucking like trying as hard as you can to like get to one second. It's so fucking dumb. No, we hit one second twice this morning. It's insane. Like why? Why are we doing that? Because like clearly you don't want it to end. You're just like waiting to like. You're just waiting, just to see a lower number. Dude, there were two one second edges this morning. There were like 10, 10 plus five second edges this morning. The low timer shit is so dumb, dude. Like, you, you can't sit here and tell me, like, it's a money thing when someone's always lined up to do it, but they're just waiting longer and longer each time just to see how low it can go. Have I been able to sleep? I was able to sleep three times today. 55 minutes, 55 minutes, and two hours. Real great sleep going on. I literally had a dream in those two hours somehow. I had enough time to even dream. I had a dream that I was back in college. Like some like like fucking like internal thing like trigger where it's like, hey, you're sleeping two hours a day and you're trying to stream. Like you're back in college, man. Like I felt that shit. Fucking flashbacks trying to stream full time while going through school. Fucking crazy man. Physical torture. We're under a minute again. Hmm. Oops. Under 50 seconds. Under 40 seconds. Fucking fake bits. That's bullshit. Under 30 seconds! Contacting the loan sharks, yeah. That's how people sound when they act like it takes a million dollars to like get it above a minute. It's crazy! Money. Thanks for the 100 bits, cooling. Banned for being unfunny. <laughs> Well... Not fucking around. <laughs> Apparently.
I wasn't even looking at the screen. Cats don't like being held like babies. Why are they baby shaped? My cat likes it. Why are they baby shaped? Under 50 seconds. As a game, it's all right. I mean, like, I like that it's like it's challenging, but like the gameplay is like pretty mid. I get that it's 1996, but like, so is Mario 64. Stream is dead. 463 viewers. Middle of the day when people are working. Stream is dead. Because I said so! Because I said so. Because I said so. Yeah, they, they couldn't say that about- They had to shut up when I was playing Sunshine. It was a game I've played before. They couldn't just say that you're a bad car when I was giving valid criticisms of Sunshine. They had to actually, like, shut up and listen. We're under a minute, by the way. Did you realize this? We're under 50, we're under 50 seconds? I got a feeling this game's gonna have a lot of volcanoes. Going under 20 seconds. It's also kind of hard to like actually play the game when this shit's going on. Like I can't even like focus on what I'm doing. We're going under 10 seconds. Under 10 seconds. Thanks for the 100 bits again. The 100 bit guy. I love the 100 bit guy. Everybody's relying on a 100 bit guy. Thanks for the 100 bits. Fucking human nature social experiment, man. Dude, the number of people on a daily basis who are like, I don't even follow, I didn't how did I get a sub? Like, dude, it just happens, man. Like it's a subathon. It is what it is. Money. Thanks for the bits. Again. Beepathon. Under 20 seconds. It's like Money. so annoying, dude. <laughs> Thanks to the 500. It's so fucking annoying. They're gonna put this shit in the psych textbook someday, yeah. Nah, because people's attention spans are about five seconds now. They need the beep to remember that it's under a minute. You think, you think that if we put an announcement at like a minute, people would actually remember five seconds later? Of course they fucking wouldn't. <laughs> Zero attention span. False, thanks for the five gifted. <laughs> beep, 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 beep. Yeah. It's so fucking dumb, dude. Congratulations, you won. Congratulations, you won. Dude, let me let me fill you in on something, all right? Congratulations. I've been accepting won. three hours of sleep at a time. I've been accepting one hour of sleep at a time. They can't get the timer above an hour. They just can't do it. As soon as it goes to like 40 minutes, they're like, oh, it's never gonna end. 10 hours? If I see 10 hours again in my entire fucking life, man. Imagine 10 hours. I, it's unimaginable. I can't even imagine seeing 10 hours. I have no money to donate! I didn't fucking ask. I didn't ask. Who asked? We're never seeing 10 hours again. I've accepted it. 
I'm just gonna be sleeping like four times a day, maybe 90 minutes each for the rest of the, however the fuck this goes on for. I've accepted it, like it's over, like we're not getting anything above like three hours of time. Bullshit. Oh, he's trying. He's trying to donate, and he doesn't know how. <laughs> I mean, fi figure it out. <laughs> Honestly, like, I don't even have the patience to like tell you how to give me money at this point. I I'm like, I'm fucking done, dude. I'm so fucking done with this beeping shit. So bad, man. Seeing a lot of no gifted badges. I mean, like, whatever, man. Like, it's. It's wait for one guy a thumb. He will save it. He will save it. This is what we signed up for. He. One hundred bits at five seconds a thon. People were legitimately gonna have anxiety attacks watching this shit. <laughs> but yeah, the fucking one hundred bits at three seconds thing is actually fucking dumb. Like what's the point? Thanks to five gifted uh, Colonel Pirate. Congratulations, you won. Who do we go? Guys, Congratulations. you understand the problem with that question, right? Like, why don't you just donate this much? Why don't you just donate, period? Dude, they're gonna fucking run out. You're still relying on one person to carry the entire subathon. Like, why not you? If you got a problem, yeah. like, it's it's really not that it's not that deep, man. Like, if you're edging the timer, it's stupid to do it under 10 seconds. And if you want the stream to continue, you give you give money. Like, it's, it's not that hard. Like, it's a subathon, dude. I miss my microwave because of the beeping. It's not, like, if there, there are two things at play here. If you want the subathon to continue, you give subs, bits, donations, whatever. And if you're waiting to see if anybody saves it before you do, you don't wait until 10 seconds. Those are the two truths of this shit. Like, it's- that's it. Like, there's, it's not that deep. Everybody's just trying to, like, like, make up these, like, fucking, like, these, like, rules and shit about, like, how- how the edging works and, like, why it happened. Like, that's- that's all it is. If you want it to continue, you, you give shit. Don't give it when it's under 10 seconds or you're being dumb. If you're waiting for it. If it's under 10 seconds and, and you think that nobody else is gonna do it, then fine, like, you can panic and do it, because otherwise you wouldn't still have this, but if you're just waiting for under 10 seconds, like, you, if your hand's on the trigger and you're waiting for that, that shit's stupid as hell. And that's how you condition people to, like, not care if it gets under 10 seconds. It really is stupid, it's, like, really dumb, because as soon as it ends, I'm gonna fucking have people asking me when the next one's gonna happen, and I'm just gonna give them the same answer next year. Why do you think I only want to do it once a year, man? It's so bad. Oh, come on. Game over. Can we start the beeping at five minutes? Based, honestly. You know, it's crazy that, like, like that's what we've come to. It's like, the beeping is, like, so often... It's so often now that people just, like, they want to start earlier. I can't even fucking focus on this game right now, man. 
I'm fucking dying. I'm literally fucking dying. And this beeping shit is driving me fucking crazy. I'm still hearing it in my head even though it's not playing. It's probably not the kind of game you want to play when you're literally like on the verge of fucking dying. If I get insomnia, you guys realize it's over, right? Like, if we continue this one hour of sleep shit, it's going to fucking end. There will be a day where I try to sleep, and it doesn't work, and then that's it. Oh, I thought you were talking about the edging makes you more angry than any 3D platformer. If we're keeping it 100 here, the movement's not very good. Like, it's kind of annoying to play, but like, whatever. That's a hot take. What? Did I not just, like, what the fuck was that? Did he not take damage when you do that? Yeah, I played Crash 4. That one was, like, pretty fun, but, like, the Cortex levels were awful and the Alligator levels were boring. It was, it was like, pretty good, though. I don't know, I liked it. I get, like, a 6.5 or a 7. I, I still hear it in my fucking head, man. The trauma, the, th the therapy. The therapy after this is over. What game is a 9 out of 10? Probably Galaxy. Like the 3D platformers? I have Galaxy in there. Other ones we've finished so far. Galaxy's probably a 9. Sly 1's like a 9.5 on this scale. Like your 9's. Negatron is so bad, dude. I can barely fucking think right now. This is awful. Yeah, I played Odyssey. It's, it's pretty good. I, I, I like it, but like, I don't know, the moon pacing is like abysmal in that game. It's like kind of annoying how the moons just feel like you don't do anything for them. Still a cool game though. It's better than Sunshine, at least casually. But I think that like we all like... We can at least recognize that when we say it's sunshine's like, like, like not that great. Like we're talking about like casual play, right? Hundred bit guy is out of bits. Uh oh. Wow, I wonder why that happened. I wonder why hundred bit guy is out of a hundred bits. It's gonna end today, dude. It's gonna fucking end today. It literally almost ended earlier. Someone gave one sub. One single sub. And it took 10 seconds for it to fucking go through. If that's not a, a wake up call, man, 
that like the hundred bits won't come through. The hundred bits aren't gonna come through. At 10 seconds, someone gives a sub and that's it. And then people complain that they gave a sub and it didn't count. Oh well, it should never get down. If you don't want the stream to end, it should never get down to that low of time. There's no excuse. For them, there's no excuse. That's bullshit. Uh, the game wasn't working yet. It was scratched and also it was like the bad version apparently. Apparently the PS2 version's better. The game seemed pretty stupid and unfun, but no. yeah, it was also scratched. Thanks, Jay, for the 69. I wonder if I'd like the original better, because this just really feels like a movement issue right now. Like, it's got that like like slow, unreal movement to it, you know. Like, if the original Crash is snappier, it's probably a lot more fun. I don't know, I just- I feel like none of these games ever get the movement right when it comes to, like, like how it feels. Is, does it feel snappier in the OG? Because these controls are kind of like, like slow, honestly. I feel like a lot of this stuff would be way easier if it weren't for like, like... It's so fucking slow, dude. Two for two. Time is going under a minute. You, you guys should fear the beep, man. The consequences of letting it beep all the time... Like, the more it happens, the more people are gonna get used to it. And you're opening the gateway to letting it get to under 10 seconds again, and like... It, like, it's just, it's just smart to not abuse the fact that it beeps in under a minute. It's just smart to not abuse the... If you want it to continue. Thanks, Colonel. Thank you, Manic. We're seeing new gifters, dude. What the fuck? Yeah, there's something going on with this game's movement, man. I jumped. I fucking jumped, man. Congratulations. This will probably be the last time I play one of these fucking Unreal remakes instead of the originals, dude. I feel like I can't even give like a fair evaluation. Nah, dude, it just feels like I can't do what I'm trying to do. It just feels like slow. I don't know, PS1 games have like a snappy feel to them. There's no way it feels like this. I just fucking hate Unreal Engine, man. It's just so slow. It really is that faithful, huh? So people just like it because it's like hard. Yeah. My rule of thumb is if, if the movement can be made a lot better, like I decided I decided I wanted the mask. If the movement can be improved, it's kind of hard to justify a challenge. You know, like it, like if it's challenging because it's like annoying to move with, it's like kind of kind of stupid. 
That's kind of how I feel right now, though, is, like, the movement's, like, really sloppy, so... It's hard to, like, get where you're trying to go. Yeah, but Source is sick, though. Source, Source is so fast and fun. Don't compare Source to Unreal Engine, bro. Come on. I'm just so sick of Unreal Engine 4, bro. I'm so tired of it. You can go behind the wall. That's cool, how do you do that? Oh, Unity? Yeah, fuck that. Dude, I, I played a couple of Unity games this subathon. They're so bad. Like, the unpolished Unity. I did think that Spyro was okay, though. Like, Spyro felt like okay, I guess. But it's still got that unreal stench to it, man. Yeah, Source is always a good time, dude. I really enjoy playing Portal. It's like very snappy, respect. It's, it's a respectful game. Like, it doesn't, like, fuck with you, you know? Yeah, Source, yeah, it's definitely one of my favorites, man, it's like, Source, I, lo I love the movement in, like, Source, Mario Sunshine, even though it has, like, delay, I still like it a lot. You know, Battle for Bikini Bottom, fuck off, dude. How far back am I going? Dude, Negatron was just, like... I wasn't the only one who felt like they were gonna fucking vomit. When that game was being played, man. Yeah, under two minutes. Beep, beep, beep. It's, it's funny until the stream ends. 100 bit guys tapped out, man. Everybody's just gonna get conditioned to, to think that if it goes under 10 seconds, it won't end. And by the time they realize it's that nobody's giving 100 bits, it's too late. If it goes under a minute, it's going under 10 seconds. Every, every time, like without fail, every single time it goes under a minute, it goes under 10 seconds. Let's hold X. Thanks for 100 bits. Just edge it at one minute, fuck it. New 100 bit guy. Yeah. New 100 bit guy! This game's autosave, right? Alright, so we're under a minute again. It's gonna end. This might be it, man. It's gonna end, dude. It's, it's so funny until you realize that, like, we're gonna th we're gonna toss the, uh, the the one month mark, which happens at 7 p.m. It's literally right there. Thanks for the hundred bits. We're tossing the Cosmic Shake playthrough this weekend, which is like the last SpongeBob game that people actually want to play. We're tossing Jack and Daxter, Ratchet and Clank, which are gonna get finished too. Money. Thanks for the bits, Colonel. This is a massive fucking toss, bro. If this ends right now. It's happening because people are letting it happen, dude. Like, everybody's lined up, like, just seeing what happens. Like, everybody's playing chicken right now. I know everybody's fucking playing chicken right now. <laughs> I've seen, like, 
like people's habits the past like 30 days. I know that everybody's here just watching to see if anybody new just like tries to contribute. Because there are like like at least like 20 people in this chat right now who are like waiting to save it. And once the waiting number goes down to like one second, it's, it's done. It already went to one second two times today. And, and you guys lost two 100 bit guys already. This is just fucking mental. This is actually just a mental activity. The 100 bit guys. Visual aid for what? You need, you need another fucking aid? And it beeps! It literally fucking beeps, bro! Like, what more do you want? Thanks for the 100 bits! <laughs> what more do you want? Yeah, we need like a, like a fucking like... Like, fire to go under the webcam. Like, what? Dude, it's like, how many excuses do you fucking want? Yeah, you want Family Guy funny moments under the timer? You want Subway Surfers going through the timer in the fucking fruit cutting game? So you have a reason to look at it? What the fuck is wrong with you guys? <laughs> Mental illness stream. We're, we are all fucking suffering. Dang, he doubles back. It's the streamer's fault. The streamer's not making it obvious enough when the timer is low. Like, what the fuck, bro? Should we put Family Guy funny moments? Like, like a little tiny, tiny little, like, square next to the timer? You know what the sad thing is? It probably would do well if we put the Family Guy funny moments or Subway Surfers as, like, a tiny little, like, fucking cube. I think it actually would help. That's why we need the beeping, man. Like, like a one minute warning, people would forget about it in seven seconds, because the average attention span of this chat is three seconds. Money. Thank you, Pi, for the hundred bits. Like, what do you fucking mean, visual aid? How about the fact that you can see it? What if we just hide it so nobody knows? Like, nobody has any idea. What if we just do that? Like when it starts oh beeping, you only know it's gonna end when it's under under one minute, and everybody just freaks the fuck out because they don't know when it's gonna end. Let's just do that. Let's just hide it so nobody can see it. Just make it permanent, regardless of time. Its presence is here forever. God, this game feels like shit to play, dude. <laughs> so boring, man. <laughs> jump, jump, jump. <laughs> we need, Pe we need Peter like holding his knee next to the timer. He spins and jumps. The only redeeming quality of this game is the challenge. And like that is just kind of like stupid, but I'm still having fun with it. Just cause it's like challenging, I guess. But it's definitely not my first choice. Yeah, the timer becomes invisible when it's under a minute, so you just have to guess whether it's under 10 seconds. Do they really just like actually emulate the jankness like perfectly in this? I just think that's cap, man. There's no way. The movement in the original has to be better, man. Yeah, false. Thank you. 
Exactly, that's why I'm saying like I probably should just play the originals. Took the L for like getting this in the combo pack before I had a PS2. Oops. Oh, it's the original's D-pad. Maybe I like that more. Dude, this is fucking dumb. Like, look at how slow this is! There's no way it's like that on PS1. I've played so many PS1 games, they don't feel like that. That's like the big thing about like PS1 is like you can like double back like every movement that you do. We're not making this. Oh, you actually probably could make that. Yeah, I don't know why like all these movement like these like, like remakes try to like redo the movement so slightly to make it like look smoother when like the jank is like fun. Oh, oops. Yeah, I like the way the actual PS1 platformers feel, yeah. Like Spider-Man felt good. I tried to get that one up in the track for me. Alright, we are in the right track. Okay. Yeah, it's so whack. It's gonna be me. This is me after day 60. Ripper Woo. I love the way OOT feels. I just I just like the way that era of games. Like, I like the way they control. fucking horrifying on PS1. Yes, I can. Thanks, man. Yeah, I, I'm always checking. So if it, if it got bought, yeah, zero minutes ago, two boxes, got it. Thank you, man. Guys, holy shit. I never thought I'd see two digits in that slot again. Thanks, man. Yeah, Creo Cards has a lot of time, man. They had more time than subs. Same amount of money, more time. Sounds good to me. You get something physical and limited. He's our family guy. Oh, 
Let's stop when you... That's what I'm saying, man. It's direct support to the streamer and also the creator of the product, and also like if they if they sell well, like we get rid of the next like 600 boxes of them, which sounds like a lot. But if, if people were doing that instead of subs, they'd already be gone. You know. If we get rid of them, there's a chance we could probably do another one next year, another series. And my bet is that if we sell like 90% of them, be, like. Like, why wouldn't you want to make more boxes, you know? <laughs> one per- Yeah. <laughs> one guy a thon. Surely one guy will buy all of them. Congratulations. Best, you thank won. you. For the gift. kind of stupid. This game's a little silly. It's alright though. I heard they get better as they go on. I like Crash 4 though. Crash 4 was awesome. Like, like, um, it's about time. Not the real one. Um, yeah, I'm sure it would run. I mean, if you can get it on your Mac. I don't know, man. So many of my viewers watch Twitch while they're working. It's like extremely common. You might have just like missed a memo or something. Yeah, working, exactly. I want to sleep soon. Man. Have I mentioned this? Like, what time is it right now? Whoa. 4 p.m. Dude, what the fuck?
not gonna lie, I had more trouble with OT than I had trouble with this game so far. The game is like weird to learn. going on with it. They like turn you around. Lives are kind of annoying to pick up. Bullshit. Negative Tron. Excuse me, are we all the way back here now? Oh my god. Sleep for a couple of hours. Timer's at eight minutes. I'm just tired, man. Like, trust me. There's nothing I can say or do to convince people that I need to sleep. But whatever. When the insomnia kicks in and I start fucking not showing up at the right times, like... At least we made it to a month. Almost. Not even. We haven't even made it to a month officially. Meta, the meta is just stringing me along at eight minutes until what like what, what do people think is gonna happen like I don't know man there, there there is no meta being played right now this will last one day like this things either change or it ends it's not gonna last like this man this is not this is not meta anymore this is just, this is just actually dumb. Two 100 bit guys, and they both ran out. It's almost like you can't rely on the same three people K 
carrying an entire subathon that's meant for a lot of people to contribute to it, and not just like three people. And there are people who've gotten used to the same three people having to do everything. So it's gotten unhealthy. We've seen some new people today, which is nice, but like... I don't know, we'll see if it's too late or not, man. I'm fucking tired. You know, he'll just keep playing games. He'll never have to sleep. <laughs> Did tax deductible? I get taxed on them. I f oh, you mean like giving to people? Yeah. I believe they are, if you just like say it's like a charitable donation or something. Yeah, if you give them, I'm pretty sure they are. I got this so it doesn't count. If you're a streamer, they are. If you're a streamer, you can mar you can write them off as a marketing expense. Because it shows your name when you when you sub the people. And it shows it on the screen. It's technically marketing. If you run your own business, you can deduct it. That's big brain shit though. Not everybody knows about that strut. For me, I'm like, I'm subbed to like three people, so I don't really bother, but yeah. You can write it off, technically. Now, I, I've just known a lot of people who stream in the past. I've learned things over the years. What is this jank, dude? Like, do they not die? Like, what the fuck is wrong with this game? Do they die? How do you kill them? What is this bullshit, man? Do you fucking kill them? Like, how do you kill them? Okay, I guess that works. I see. I'll tell you what's gonna happen, man. One of these days, like, once we play Cosmic Shake, I'm just gonna start sleeping. And if it hits zero, I don't fucking care. That's, that's how it's gonna go. One of these days, I'll just start fucking sleeping. And then it's up to you guys to not let it edge for six straight hours without any entertainment while I'm, I'm gone. That's what's gonna happen, like, that's the only shot you have. That's the only shot we have this actually being fun again. Either way. Right? If it's 6 a.m., people are staying up. I think a lot of the edging is just that people want to see my reaction to it. Think about it, right? Like, do you really think that people will be stringing it at one minute if I'm sleeping and everybody's up, like, trying to, like, save it? No, they'd fucking give, like, five at a time just so they don't have to, like, hear the beeping noise. People just want to hear me react to it. Yeah, right? Like, that's that's gotta be what it is. That's, that's definitely it. I mean, I've, I've, I've fucking, like, legitimately asked, like, to, to have a visual indicator on the screen. Like, that, that's the level we've reached. Visual indicator on the screen for when it's under a minute, because, because you know, the fucking beeping isn't enough to tell you the stream is going to end in 37 seconds. 
Needs to be more stimulating though. Once once we've done everything that I want to do, I'm just gonna start sleeping no matter what. And then it's up to the people like I'm sorry to the people who like stay up all night to try and stop the edging, but like if I can't stream, it's just not even gonna work at all. Like I need to be able to sleep. We're going under 10 seconds. Let's see who saves it. Let's wait for some wait for one person to do it. Money. Thanks, Traffy, for the hundred bits. Money. Thanks. Thanks. Money. Thank you, Zappy. Yeah. I'm too tired for this shit, man. I literally can't even fucking process what's happening on this screen right now. the bits everybody money guys timer guys timer guys timer guys timer guys timer guys timer thanks Z for the the gift guys timer 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 guys streams gonna end guys timer Stream is ending in, in seconds, in number of seconds, number of seconds, number of seconds. Timer, 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 beep, 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 beep. Stream is ending, timer, timer, timer. Subathon, timer, timer, timer. I bet some people got off to that, like some people just ejaculated to all that shit just now. You just want to hear me talk about how it's going to end, like it, it just gets you off, you just like to hear it. I like it when Shift's voice tells me the stream's about to end and then it doesn't, I get a high off of it. Thanks for the bits. Thanks for the bits. I am the visual. Hey Shift, can you add Family Guy funny moments under the timer so I remember to look at it? Money. Thanks for the bits. Try playing Crash Bandicoot off of one hour of sleep three days in a row. It's fucking awesome, man. Money. Isn't this so fun? Greetings, Bundle Dingle here. Thank you. Bruh. I edged for forty hours straight till my balls exploded. 
which chap made me do it. <laughs> I think it's time for Tubby Custard, man. It will never end. Fucking punishment for it. Time to shoot some hoops. Based honestly. I'm starting to dissociate from my body now. Did you sleep? No. No, I didn't fucking sleep. I'm getting naps, dude. I'm literally just getting fucking naps for the past three days. So no, I didn't fucking sleep. I just want to fucking get the Spongebob games done, man. That was the whole point of this subathon. Nobody wants to play them, understandably, because they're so bad. The rest of them that we have left are just shit. And then Cosmic is being saved. Like, I just... I want to I wanna get my goals done for this subathon, and then I'm just gonna sleep no matter what. And I'm sorry, but they're what? gonna- it's gonna be responsible for the people who are- People who are staying up all night to make sure it doesn't end are gonna be responsible once I start sleeping, man. I'm like, I can't do this, dude. It's so fucking awful. Is it worth it? Like, the permanent fucking physical damage? Money. Dude, getting six hours I'm of sleep at night long-term causes broke, permanent damage. And I'm a fucking doctor. Money. Six hours of sleep for a long period of time causes permanent damage. Years 2053. The subathon has finally ended. After 30 years of straight edging, it killed everyone involved. <laughs> but it was worth it in the end. It was worth it in the end. It was worth it in the end. It was all worth it. Said shift. Dead. I can't believe nobody's taking advantage of the Creo cards yet, yeah, man. Bizarre. It was worth it. Money. Thanks for the bits, sir. I forgot what I was gonna say. It's probably more of the same. Every box represents a day without sleep. <laughs> but like, having to shove food down my face. And just like, feel shitty every day. torture a At least I'm getting paid, but I'm not even sure if it's worth it at this point, dude. I think that, like, a year ago, I didn't have the self-respect to admit that, like, I'm not sure if it's worth it, like, how much, like, money I'm making with how fucking awful this is. Nah, I ain't no way shifties dying from a spongeo fawn. I sure hope ball. Mr. Streamer doesn't pass away from playing all these bits on the above game. Ah. <laughs> 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 
Mid is generous. Mid is very generous. Yeah, are, are we really like... Do you really think that like the fucking Game Boy games are gonna make a top 10 list? Like who cares if we play them or not? But yeah, we gotta finish Cosmic Man. The other ones are just fucking disposable. There are spears coming out of the walls, but like... I don't think you understand that my decision-making process is like, like three seconds delayed from my hands right now. This feels almost impossible right now. I'm just so fucking tired, dude. find another way to make profit without torturing myself. This is just enough. I think this is the wrong way. The Money. fucking, the fucking, yeah. Wire transfer for gifting subs. No sus. Thanks for the bits, Roto. That was fucking disgusting. Making 10 cents a sub. That was like actually just like fucking like torture. S slave wages. That's, that's one day. That's one sleep session out of like two to three per day. One day of a subathon for that last of the month. Yeah, right. So fucked up. And, and it like it's like ten dollars, and you just sit here, and you don't get you don't get paid for like four days. It's so terrible. You know how many streamers are doing subathons and probably getting ripped off right now who don't know about that exploit? I feel bad they don't know. I, I usually don't like to check the, the revenue. Like, I don't want to check the revenue during these. That's not the point when I'm doing it. When I'm doing it, it's about the entertainment. When I'm done, you check the revenue, but... Now I have to check the revenue, which makes it fucking annoying for me. I'm, think I'm like physically thinking about it now. Thanks for bits. He saved it, he saved it. Money! Thanks for the bits. Have you ever seen low timer shenanigans like this in any other subathon though? Like, it's ridiculous. Checkpoint pacing this game is really weird. Money. Thank you, Falco. For the gift sub to I farted. Congratulations, you won. What's up with the check?
I wouldn't complain if I get like, like the edging doesn't bother me as long as I know I'm gonna get to sleep. But now it's just like constant beeping when I'm trying to like enjoy these games and give my thoughts on them. But I, I can't even like process these games in my head while I'm playing them right now because I'm too tired and the fucking timer just makes it even harder to think about them. The whole thing has been derailed. The first week was so healthy, but like. Like, what even is this now, man? Cause I'm down now if you notice, but the timer is below one minute. Thank you. Congratulations, you won. Whoa! The fuck was that? Okay, I guess we won. Uh, they were gonna get to that point. This just feels like a continuation of the last one, man. It just feels like the logical progression of the last one. Thank you, Gold. That's the 1500. This is this is just what happens when the edging goes on like this, man. Like, if the last one didn't end the day that it ended, we would have just gotten this point anyway. They're very different games. They're not very comparable platformers. I'd say this is comparable to Spyro, or not Spyro, uh, Sly. But even then, like, Sly, Sly came way, way after this game, so it's not really fair to say it's better or worse. Like, obviously, like, the Sly does, like, were inspired by this game, so yeah. Sly, Sly just, like, per like, perfected this whole concept. Fuck off. Yeah. Thank you. What's better, this or Acid Reflux? What, the game? Or like, or like staying up for days? I, th I think I'd rather have Acid Reflux. I've, I've had Acid Reflux in the past. It's pretty awful, but it's not as awful as this. Like, 
This poor shit is actually evil, man. Every single life that I had to that one fucking section. <laughs> you can just walk on them. Was it like that in the original? I've noticed that in some areas of this game you can walk on places that are like kind of awkward like you shouldn't be able to. Can you spin these guys to get rid of them? No. How do you kill these guys? Do you jump on them? Okay. You just can't kill them. You can slam in this game. So annoying. I hate Unreal. I use that to get around the boar in the later section. Thanks, Andrew, yeah. for the gift. What's the plan for sleep? Are we like trying to make a push at some point or am I just gonna be up like this for the next like 10 hours? I'm, I'm genuinely asking. I'm not like... I'm, I'm, I'm actually like asking right now. Like what is the actual plan? Why is this so far back? I guess they kept the checkpoints faithful too. Like what? Did I miss a checkpoint? Oh my god, dude. I can't even see what I'm doing, dude. I'm so fucking tired.
know what this, you know what sucks? You know what actually sucks? You wanna know what sucks? It's like really fucking hard to enjoy any of these games. In the current state that we are playing in. That's what really fucking sucks. Like I'm being robbed of all these like first time experiences. I'm just I'm just selling them for money. If I weren't fucking collapsing, I'd probably enjoy them a little more though. Money. Thanks for the bits. It's funny every time. They did the thing, guys. They kept it under money. a minute to recycle the beeping noise. Money. Thanks for the bits. You know, like, it literally takes one sub to stop this from happening, right? Like, it literally just takes one sub to get this out of the fucking one minute shit. Money. I want you guys to enjoy it. You guys, you guys secretly enjoy it, don't you? Like, you just want it to... You just want it to keep going. Money. Life support, exactly. Why did I go so low? Thanks, Asterix. Give the edgers control, we get fucking sleep deprivation, exhaustion, beeping all the time. I know there are people, like, there are people who are trying to save the stream and there are people who are edgers. Like, there, there's a difference. And, like, if you just held it at, like, like an hour or something, we, we wouldn't even be having fucking problems, man. Like, I've been, I've been somehow surviving off of, like, like, two hour sleep sessions, okay? Like, we can't even get this fucking timer above a minute. It's- it's- it's so stupid at this point, man. I just can't stand the mentality that it's like impossible to get it over an hour anymore. This is fucking madness, man. Congratulations, you won. has to do anything necessarily but like not anything but this man it's it's so obvious that like chat's doing it because i'm just like i'm just i have no self-respect like i'm just fucking going to bed for like 90 minutes and just taking it so now the timer doesn't go above two hours because two hours is too much sleep for shift it's 
so fucking obvious what they're doing, man. That's, that's literally what it's gotten to. Like, the less I'm willing to accept, like, I should just fucking lower it to a minute per sub, honestly. You guys can handle it. You guys genuinely can handle a minute per sub. That's the stupid part, like... There's no reason for this to be happening. If I'm not sleeping, then fuck it, man. Can we get the combo? Fuck off, man. Money. Thank you, hand basket. Yeah, exactly. It's, it's like it couldn't be more obvious what the solution is. Like, a minute and thirty for the Creo cards, man. A minute and thirty for the same value as sub is one twenty. Like, what the fuck? Yeah, two boxes adds 15 minutes at a time, yeah. Dude, what the hell are you talking about? That's just a question that's, that's first of all bait, but also second, shows you that you didn't watch any of the Subathon. And third, you have no idea how little of sleep I've been getting the past three weeks. And fourth, you're a jackass. And fifth, you haven't watched any of these playthroughs at all. And in sixth, like, you're comparing me playing a game that I've played for fucking seven years every single day to a game I've literally never touched in my life. Money. But yeah, when I'm frame perfect parrying on Metroid Dread and, and you're fucking not here to watch it, like, yeah, sure, man. Or maybe you were here and you're pretending you weren't watching that. I wanna see your fucking Mario Sunshine gameplay, you fucking jackass. Money. Well, Guitar Hero. What's your best score under the fire and the flames? Fucking jerk. Money. Money. I'm literally progressing through the game. I'm not even getting stuck on anything. These fucking Andes with like, I played this game since I was a kid, and I'm better than you. Like, good for you, dude. It's my first fucking time playing the game. Go fuck yourself. Just ban him. Money. Cause these people have such little dignity, they'll still fucking rear their ugly faces after getting ripped on like that. You have no self-respect. I, I will still see you in my chat Money. after making it very clear I don't want you here. You're a fucking loser. Money. Money. Yeah, Shift sucks at video games. He's only good at a game where literally every fucking move is frame perfect for 40 minutes straight. What the fuck is Money. wrong with you, dude? K underscore. 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 Yeah, this, this is this is the mindset of K somebody who thinks they're good at video games. K underscore. K underscore. K. Wow, you seem to be dying a lot on a on a casual game you never played before. I guess I'm better at games than you. Well, you're literally good at nothing. 
Just protect your ego by never putting yourself in a situation where you can be criticized for being bad at something, dude. Play play a game you've never played before in front of 600 people and see how it goes off of not sleeping at all. Fucking beep 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 in your fucking ear the whole time. Like, yeah, this is clearly the primary thing that I'm thinking about right now, is playing your stupid fucking game. Money. This game isn't even fucking good, man. It's literally just a rage game. Whoa. And I'm not even fucking raging at it. I'm not even fucking getting mad at this game at all. I'm not getting stuck on anything, I'm not raging at it, and you still fucking have something to say. You can't fucking win, man. You literally can't win with these people. Money. Based honestly. Fucking hundred bit spam. Money. Week five off to a great start. Money. I'm all out. I don't give a fuck if I'm good at this game, dude. Nobody fucking gives a fuck about this game. Who the fuck cares, man? It's not even the original. Like, nobody fucking cares about this game. I don't need your fucking validation to tell me I'm good at something. But I'm also not gonna fucking take disrespect in my own chat. Like, fuck off with that shit. I'm not even able to fucking enjoy it. Yeah, it's really easy to fucking bait somebody who's just fucking running their mouth because they've lost the ability to fucking process anything. I don't think these people have ever been fucking tired or overworked in their entire life, man. I swear. You're all a bunch of fucking pussies, man. Have you ever had a night where you miss sleep? Like, like, uh, seriously. Seriously. Have you ever been tired in your entire fucking life? i a fucking circus act. I'm sitting here fucking walking a tightrope for 600 people and I fucking haven't slept in a week. Like, fuck off. Modern day circus fucking performer, man. What's up with the fucking collision on this block, oh man? No? Money! Oh my god, I'm gonna fucking scream. Please stop torturing me. Yeah. Please stop. Was so close! Is it really that fucking exciting, man? Is it that exciting?
won. Congratulations, you won. What do you think, guys? Think I can get in a 20 minute nap? Congratulations, you won. Yes. No crouching. Cool. Yeah. Thought it was a fucking actual 2D game for a second. I don't even know what I'm fucking playing now. You won. Oh, you want to stop edging? Get a fucking job and give me money. You won. Like, like, I'm tired of the fucking. I'm, I'm tired of all this shit, man. I'm tired of people fucking complaining about people not giving money. First and foremost, like, there's something you can fucking do about it. Go shovel a fucking. Go, go, go shovel snow. Go mow a lawn. Do something. Instead of fucking ask people to do shit. Like, I'm just tired of all. I'm tired of all this shit, man. I'm tired of fucking hearing all this shit. And now I'm being fucking criticized for my fucking gameplay in a fucking random game that I've never played before on top of all this shit. Nothing is ever good enough for you people, man. What the fuck is the consequence? Like, like, seriously. I've been saying for fucking three weeks that it's gonna get to this point. I've been saying this for three fucking weeks and people are like surprised that I can barely even function anymore. Like, like, what the fuck is- what is wrong with everybody, man? Just fucking end it! Just end it, man! Just stop giving me fucking money already! If it's gonna be like this, nobody's enjoying this anymore! The only people who are fucking enjoying this are the people who are trying to torture me! Just fucking stop already! What's the point? What's the fucking point? Double money. This is how we all fucking feel, man! I'm- this is the quiet part that all the real fans are thinking! Nobody's enjoying this anymore, just let it fucking end! It's, it's, a point, it's at the point where I don't fucking care. I, I just don't care anymore, man. I, I have too much self-respect to subject myself to this another fucking year. Alright? Like, you're literally just fucking trolling me with this hundred bit shit when it's under a minute. Yeah. You just beep, 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 beep! I'm sitting here fucking playing this shit game! I can barely fucking move the control sticks at this point. You won. I haven't slept in weeks! And I beep, beep, beep! And you think it's funny? Who is this for now? This is for nobody! This is for all the people who fucking hate my guts! That's who this is for now! You've lost it! You've lost the stream! It was over weeks ago! This was over weeks ago when you fucking forfeited this shit to the people who want to troll me! This is what this is now! This is what you get for letting it get to this point instead of just fucking ending it! It's not your stream anymore! You lost it! You know it's true! You know it's been like this for weeks! When was the last time we actually enjoyed a game on here, man? We shouldn't do this anymore! We shouldn't fucking do these stupid ass fucking subathons anymore, man!
In two hours, I'm playing Cosmic Shake. I don't give a fuck if you watch or not. I'm finishing the Spongebob games. That's the whole fucking reason why I did this. Just to, to get a tier list of the fucking games. That's why we did this in the first place. I'm playing the game in two hours. I don't give a fuck if you watch. And I'm going to bed as soon as that's done. If I come back and I check the VOD and it doesn't hit zero, then we will continue this fucking madness. But I'm going to sleep after 7 p.m. when I play that game. I am going to sleep. Money. This is literally just being taken advantage of, man. Literally no other fucking streamer sits here, regardless of how tired they are, streaming to make sure that it doesn't hit zero. To make sure they're here when it hits zero, to be part of it when it's over. I don't care anymore. I'm literally, like, I'm not fucking even streaming for the people who care anymore. This is just for people who are fucking trolling me. Okay? I'm, I'm finishing what I want tonight, and then it's done. After that point, it's in your hands. If you, if you want to continue with this shit, fine. Fine. But nothing lost. Nothing lost if we finish that game and it's over. When the tier list is done, I don't care anymore. I don't care anymore. And you bet your fucking ass this is not happening next year after this shit. It's not happening like this, man. It's not okay. I'm reconsidering streaming at this point. I'm reconsidering streaming at this point after this shit. It's not fucking funny anymore, man. It's- I literally feel like you're just exploiting the fact that you know I'm not gonna give up on the stream. I'm literally the one fucking person on this platform who will not abandon the stream. And this is the thanks that I get. The fucking- like, the fucking 100 bits at 3 seconds just to FUCK WITH ME?! GIVE ME A FUCKING BREAK, MAN! JUST FUCKING END IT ALREADY! YOU LITERALLY THROWING DIMES AT ME TO FUCKING TROLL ME WHEN I HAVEN'T SLEPT IN WEEKS! THIS IS WHY YOU ALL FUCKING TREAT ME LIKE SHIT! BECAUSE I DON'T SET ANY BOUNDARIES! YOU'RE FUCKING RIGHT, MAN! AND NOW ON TOP OF THIS, I GOT PEOPLE COMING IN HERE TELLING ME I'M SHIT AT GAMES! WHY DID I DO ANY OF THIS?! WHY DID I FUCKING FOUND THIS FUCKING COMMUNITY ON THIS GAME?! THAT NONE OF YOU FUCKING RESPECT! I FUCKING FOUGHT TOOTH AND NAIL TO GAIN A SHRED OF RESPECT IN THE FUCKING SPEEDRUNNING COMMUNITY JUST TO HAVE NONE OF IT! AFTER SEVEN YEARS, YOU ALL STILL FUCKING THINK THAT I SUCK AT VIDEO GAMES! I can't fucking win, man! I literally try harder than anybody on this fucking platform! And I can't fucking get a break! I'm just so over this fucking Twitch shit, man! It's all fucking mental illness on this goddamn platform! It's all fucking narcissists! If you don't fucking try to attract attention, you just fucking fail! You cannot survive on this platform without being an attention whore! You have to do these fucking subathons to make ends meet and people fucking do the turkey shit when they give you 10 cent subs to sit and do tubby custard in a fucking teletubby outfit! This is a fucking clown show! This website needs to fucking die, man! I can't do it anymore! My fucking- my own fucking fans don't even respect me, man. Can we just go back to the days when I could just, like, like, stream something that I was passionate about and be able to make a decent living off of it? No, we can't. Because you all take that for granted, too! You all fucking shit on me for putting time into something! If I were playing Mario, you'd be fucking sucking my fucking cock! You'd be dumping the subs on me if I were fucking playing 120 Star! But no, I chose the fucking Yellow Man game! And this is the fucking thanks I get for doing that! I chose the wrong game to invest 20,000 hours into if I wanted to fucking live a comfortable life and I had to fucking subject myself to this shit every fucking year. Yeah, that's right. Maybe in the next life, I'll be appreciated.
Maybe in the next life I won't be called a fucking lunatic for actually putting time into something that's worth it! You're welcome for your fucking remake, by the way! You're welcome for all of that shit! Money! Whoa. Fucking hate this website. Game fucking hate this website. Over. This is this is literally what it is now, man. You have to fucking torture yourself to do anything interesting on this fucking platform. You have to fucking torture yourself, or just be a fucking freak. Be a fucking freak or torture yourself to get any kind of fucking attention on this platform. I don't want attention anymore, man. I just want to fucking play my game. I do an honest job improving my game. That used to be enough back in the day. It's not enough anymore. It all started with the fucking hot tubs, man. That's where it all fucking started is the beginning of the end. I fucking hate this website. I, it's the amount of disrespect to throw pennies at me when the timer is at 10 seconds I just have the fucking beeping going forever. The amount of fucking disrespect, man. And you expect me to thank you for the dollar every time you throw it at me? It's fucking... Who the fuck do you think you are, man? It's just fucking funny. Thanks for throwing fucking nickels at me while I sit here and listen to this shit. For weeks straight. Thanks, man. I don't fucking owe you anything. Fucking honoring the tubby custard shit? He was gonna have me do that shit for 24 hours straight for 10 cents a pop. Getting paid like $2 an hour. But you're a streamer. You don't deserve to make any money. Be grateful you even make a fucking penny. I don't have to fucking do these subathons either, man. When was the last time I did a sub goal before this shit, man? I haven't asked for a single sub in the past year. I haven't, I haven't, I haven't even asked for subs this fucking subathon. I, I do a sub incentive for like once in a year. And this is this is what I get for doing it. I really thought that doing these subathons could mean that I could just focus on doing something that, that I actually feel this website is missing these days. With, with the actual fucking serious speed running. I used, to, I used to tell myself, like, someday they'll miss it. Someday they'll appreciate it. That's just not enough anymore, man. I'm tired of living my life for what the future is gonna be like. I never get to enjoy the present. So I'm just always thinking about, someday they'll realize. Someday they'll realize how much this fucking guy did for these games, man. But do I fucking care what these people think of me anymore, man? You're, you're fucking lucky I still like playing that game. You're so lucky. I would have been gone from this website years ago. And some of you are so fucking entitled to act like... <laughs> you act like, why doesn't he just stream variety? Why doesn't he just do what I like? Because I don't fucking like it, man! I'm literally only accepting- I'm only doing this because I'm getting paid. This fucking variety shit? It's literally a sub-incentive. I'm going out of my way to fucking get all these old consoles, minus this one I didn't end up doing. But literally every other fucking game I've gone out of my way to spend like hundreds of dollars on getting the original version, the original console. Like, I, I put so much effort into this to make it like fucking perfect. And I'm getting trolled. People throwing the dollar at me every 10 seconds to fucking have the beeping sound in my ear and I can't even fucking sleep. I haven't even adjusted the sub timer. 
in, in like two weeks. It's been like at 120 for two weeks. And they were perfectly fine getting in enough time for me to sleep. Just so I could be here for the end of it. And to help it go on a little bit longer. And as soon as I start accepting 90 minutes of sleep, what do you know? It never goes over 90 minutes. It doesn't even go over an hour anymore. Because they know that I'll fucking take it. I'll take the bullshit, man. They know that I'll just fucking bend my ass over and fucking take it. It's just fucking abuse at this point. Just get, get past the whole money thing. This is like nothing. I'm fucking accepting dollars to fucking listen to this shit. Like, the whole point was just to fucking, like, like, have a, de like, a definitive opinion on all these trash games. All the fucking shitty Spongebob games people just, like, split hairs over. I just wanted to, like, have an opinion on it. Actually, like, get through them. And then it's just turned into this. I don't even know what this fucking game is. It's a fucking shitty Unreal remake of an already shitty game. This is fucking bonus game shit, man. Nobody even knows what they want me to play anymore. But do you even want this anymore? Do you even want this stream? You just want to fucking troll me. It's just trolling at this point. I, I can tell, man. I can, I can see the people, who, like the actual fans who were enjoying this three weeks ago. They see it too. They're fucking pissed off too, man. Just trolling at this point. Fucking one dollar. You want me to thank you every ten seconds for one dollar? Beep, beep, beep. You're fucking shitting on everybody who's ever fucking donated a cent to the stream. You want it to be unwatchable. And you think it's funny, too. You think it's fucking funny. It is fucking funny. If you hate my guts, just admit it. Just fucking admit that you hate my guts. You have no respect for me. I don't care anymore. I've always been the fucking enemy. I don't fucking care anymore, man. It's over. You don't just fucking become crazy, man. You don't just fucking wake up and up. Oh, I'm crazy now. I fucking lost my shit. I'm raging at everything. I'm always fucking angry all the time. Why the fuck do you think I'm angry all the time? It's just fucking years, man. It's just fucking years of this shit. Nobody's ever fucking given me a shred of respect in any fucking space I've been a part of ever. I fucking walked on eggshells for three fucking years in the middle of all this shit. Just to try and get some people to fucking like me. And I just can't get a fucking break. I still can't get a fucking break. And as soon as I stop walking on eggshells, everybody just fucking goes back to hating me anyway. So fuck it, man. I love being hated, because it's all I'm fucking good at! It's all I'm fucking good at, man, is just fucking receiving hate. That's all I'm good at. I just love being the fucking clown. I love everybody fucking hating me and fucking taking advantage of me. I love it! It's the only fucking consistent thing in my life. What a fucking disaster. Congratulations, man. you won. Congratulations, you won. Fucking speedrunners were always jealous of my game. They fucking steal my ideas, don't give me credit for them, and then shit on my game. Just to discredit it. They steal my layouts, they steal my subathon ideas, they fucking steal everything. And I'm still a fucking joke. I'm still a fucking joke to everybody. Simulator. Y'all a bunch of fucking losers. 
Fucking take yourself too seriously. This fucking speed running esports shit. You ruined the hobby. Fucking Minecraft esports. Go outside, you fucking losers. Touch grass. I'm tired. I'm just fucking tired, dude. Everybody just wants somebody to validate their hobby. It's never because they want to do it, it's always because they want to fucking prove they're better than somebody. Mental illness simulator. How did I get surrounded by people that just fucking hate themselves, man? It makes me hate myself. Why'd you put it on emote only mode? Don't you want to see how people really feel about me? Don't you want to see it? Stop lying to yourselves. Just go ahead. Just go ahead and do it. I literally have people who are addicted to fucking trolling me. They literally have fucking private servers where they recruit people to harass me while I'm streaming. What the fuck did I do, man? What did I do? What did I do to deserve this? Please tell me. Please tell me what I did. I've done nothing but tried. All fucking seven and a half years I've been on this platform and I get nothing but shit from everybody. And now it's just, it's fucking infected my own fucking fans too. It's the amount of disrespect, man. I can't even get mad at you guys because it's just part of the job. It's literally just to be a, to be a successful streamer, you have to be a fucking clown. All I ever wanted is not to be treated like a clown. All I ever wanted all these fucking years. It's not even about the subathon, man. The subathon just puts it plain in front of everybody, but it goes deeper than that. There's nothing you can do about it, man. I chose the wrong game. It all just comes down to that I chose the wrong game. You know that's the root of everything. Is that it's Spongebob. That's what it is, man. That's what it's always been. I've done everything right. I've tried as hard as I could. It's Spongebob. And that's it. And without me, you wouldn't have any of it. If I can't fucking do it, nobody can. I was the best chance you had. And getting actual good SpongeBob games again. I was I was your one shot. The day I give up is the day it's all gone, man. They couldn't even move 200,000 copies of Cosmic Shake. Baby steps. I, mean, I can't even remember where I am in this fucking game right now. Man. It's all. It's all the fucking SpongeBob, man. It's where it all started. I literally came into this fucking stream community having to defend myself from day one. The first fucking day I turned on my stream, I was already getting picked on, and I had to defend myself. Literally the first fucking day. It's always been that way. I've always been fucking treated with disrespect. I've always been on the fucking side of the aisle where I had to defend myself. To get a fucking shred of it. And this is and this is just the fucking manifestation of it, man. This is seven years of showing people that you have no boundaries. And then you'll just keep fucking doing the dance every day when nobody fucking respects you or appreciates you. The one thing I never learned how to do is walk away. 
That's the one thing I could never do is walk away. It's my, my biggest flaw. I never learned how to walk away from people who don't fucking appreciate me or respect me. I never learned how to put my foot down. I've always given everybody a second chance. And as soon as I put my foot down with some people and the way I'm treated by some people in some places, in some spaces, in some games, some communities, now I'm just fucking evil. Now everybody fucking hates me now. Because I demanded any sort of fucking shred of respect and decided not to be walked on by literally everybody in my fucking life at last, right? At fucking last. But now I'm just fucking, he fell off, he's evil. Why does he still play this game? Why doesn't he wear the hat and fucking play the game with the saturated colors anymore? Why doesn't he do that stuff anymore? Why doesn't he put on the fucking clown nose and put on some fucking makeup? Just do it already. That's all we fucking looked at you as anyway. I always knew Shift sucked at games. I always knew it. I always knew it. Keep my words, man. I'm not gonna make it to 10 years as a streamer. I'm literally over this shit, man. Like, I just wanna fucking- I wanna enjoy my life, man. I'm always gonna love the fucking Spongebob runs, but I'm, I'm not doing it for you guys anymore, man. You already know this. I wish there were an economically viable way to justify it. That's the one thing I can't get over. I thought this was it, man. I thought that I thought these subathons were like this was gonna be how I could justify it. But the self-respect I have to sacrifice to earn that justification, I'm not sure if it's worth it anymore, dude. A lot has changed in the past year. I, I thought it was just a matter of like, oh, I don't care about what people think. I'll just torture myself. Whatever they think doesn't matter. Like. It does kind of matter, man. You gotta have some respect for yourself at some point. I'm just tired of going through my life just not having any respect for myself. This is like just the, the peak of just self-disrespect is this fucking heinous act that we are committing right now. Yeah, change is bad when you've been the same fucking streamer for seven years and nobody wants to let you change. I fucking hate this man. I was doomed from the day I first started streaming. Day one, people in my chat, why are you playing Spongebob, you fucking loser? Day one. And people want to say that I'm an asshole, that I'm mean, that I'm evil. You fucking made me this way. You fucking made me this way. What would you fucking do? Would you walk away? What if I walked away? Either I fucking am the way I am, or I walked away. And you know it's true. You know it's fucking true, man. And it's your fucking fault. It's people like you, man. It's people like you who drive a perfectly reasonable and grounded person to insanity. It's people like you. It's being stuck on the internet all the time. Because this isn't me. I've been trying to fucking get away from this shit, man. This fucking streaming shit is mental illness. It wasn't like this seven years ago. I don't know when it- I don't know when it devolved to this point, man, but... Like, it's just- it's just not like it was seven years ago, man. It felt like there was a level of respect to this, like, seven years ago. And fucking Joe Schmo can just jerk off on stream and light a firework and become famous. Like, it's just- it's fucked, man. You can't- you can't be the guy who wants to be respected by his own community. Everybody has to be a clown. Everybody has to play the game, dude. Everybody has to play the game, and if you're not playing it, you're a fucking chump. You're a fucking chump. This is the drama that is making you watch right now. One fourth of you are watching because there's drama. Yeah. And I'm telling you, it wasn't like this seven years ago, man. 
I don't need any support from anybody anymore, man. I'm tired of all the fucking talk. There's nothing you can say to make seven and a half years with mental torture go away. If I just picked the right game, everybody would fucking jerk me off. Everybody would love me and respect me. But I chose the wrong game. That's where it all started. That's where it all started, man. It all started with an extraordinary person picking a game that gets fucking shit on. I could have been the best at anything. And I chose the thing that I wanted to be the best at. And this is the thanks I get. From everybody. From everybody. And now, and now it's gotten to the point where I'm getting trolled by the people who fucking support me. This is Twitch now, man. This is Twitch. If I, play, if I played Zelda for the first time in 2016, I probably would have picked that. And you never would have known how good that Spongebob game was. And I'd be a hell of a lot happier. I wonder if it was worth it, man. Because my brain is on three seconds of delay right now, I can't even process the pattern that is going on in front of me. I don't even think that, like, any amount of effort could get me to fucking get past this level right now. With how fucked it is. Zelda's a good game too, man. I should have picked that. I wouldn't have to explain myself to literally every fucking person on this website if I just picked that. I'm just the king of making everything harder. <laughs> I'm just the king of making everything harder for myself. It's, it's past the point, dude. I, I like, like, like 17,000 hours in something that, like, like, I'm still fighting to, like, show people is, like, actually as good as it is. It's never gonna happen. Maybe I just like it. Maybe I just don't have any self-respect. It's where it starts, man. That's where it all started. That's what got me in this situation. It's a shame nobody else sees it but me. Fucking fans complaining to me. Congratulations, you won. You're gonna do a casual playthrough of BFBB, but we see it enough when you're not doing a subathon. Fuck you. I'm tired of this game. I'm tired of it. I'm tired of it. You know how fucking tired I am of people complaining about the game that I spend 10 hours a day playing? You know how tired I am of fucking my own fans complaining to me about the time I invest in something as if they're investing it themselves as if you can't just walk away now the hate's close to home now ma'am it's gotten to the point where I'm literally being trolled by my own viewers now torture a has begun all I ever wanted was just fucking like be respected I don't care what you think as long as you respect me yeah. I don't care if you like me, I just want you to respect me. That's all I ever wanted. I'll be the most hated person in the entire speedrunning community as long as you have a shred of respect for what I do with my game. I just never felt that way. I've always had to fucking justify to people why I play it. And jump through hoops doing any other fucking thing but Spongebob to show people that I'm not fucking trash at video games. When all they had to do was just try the game that I play to see how hard it is. But they would never step foot on my turf because they know, they know what it's like. They just don't want to admit it. Is that, is that where the mental block is? Is that why we just can't fucking admit? 
This shift is just as valid as everybody else who fucking... I spent more time than I, I've had more hours in the, in my one game than everybody except for like the Golden Eye Runners, man. At this point, money. And what? What? The, here's the thanks that I get. At the point, my own fans are fucking begging me to stop trying. You know how much that sucks. If I at least had my own fans backing me, maybe I wouldn't care as much, man. I have my own fans dragging me in the opposite direction to fucking do variety just for this shit to happen where I can't even enjoy this. I can't. I'm playing all these games the first time and I'm getting edged at fucking four seconds with a dollar being thrown at me. Expect to thank somebody for the dollar every 10 seconds just to hear the beeping in my ear while I'm fucking playing this game on 55 minutes of sleep. I mean, like, what the fuck? So you're tired of that. You're tired of that shit. You wanna troll me with this shit? Maybe I should just fucking stop streaming. Maybe I should just go back to recording my runs without a webcam and just like show you the gameplay like the good old days. Maybe I'm the problem. Maybe I'm the fucking problem. Maybe I'm admitting that, that what I'm doing isn't worth it and I need to fucking put my stupid face on the screen to give any fucking reason to turn on this shit anymore when I'm not doing a subathon or talking about drama. I'm just so fucking tired of the internet, man. The internet has given me the opportunity to show people something that I felt got left behind and needed respect and attention. But everything else fucking sucks about it, man. The rest of this shit fucking sucks, dude. I don't even know if it's worth it anymore. I just need to get rich and just go back to fucking playing it without a webcam. That's what needs to fucking happen, dude. I need to just fucking get rich and just not depend on this anymore. That is the only day I'll be free is when I can just stop needing streaming and just do it because I want to do it. Isn't that sad? This fucking internet, man. The fucking internet, dude. You don't fucking... You don't understand what this does to people, man. Like, being a full-time streamer for seven years. You don't understand what this fucking does to your mental health. Like, like how much shit I just fucking shove away every fucking day. I just know that if I'm not being an attention whore, I'm on my fucking deathbed. The shelf life is almost up. If you're not just scooping up all the attention you can fucking get and playing the game that everybody else is playing. It wasn't like that seven years ago. Phil's a G, man. God bless him. He's, he's the man who knew how to walk away. When that community was starting to fucking do their dumb shit, he just walked away. He realized early on how fucking mentally ill speedrunning community is, man. And he, he is successfully dissociated from it. I respect that guy so much for just knowing when to fucking walk away. It's literally flip sides of the same coin, because I know he cares, man. He loves his game too, but he just can't anymore, because he can't deal with it. He can't deal with the fucking mental illness that comes with this shit, man. The baggage of this the fucking speedrunning community. People just come here for refuge, man. The speedrunning shit, literally just fucking ego refuge. Fucking, I started speedrunning when I was feeling bad about myself. It's like, it's such a trap, dude. It's just miserable people encouraging miserable behavior. And you just, like... I can't walk away, man, because I, I know that, like, there's got to be a way to make it work. To just not, like, attract that fucking shittiness to it. Like, how how can we fucking make this work, man? Without, like, fucking putting ourselves on pedestals and, like, acting like it's so fucking serious, but also taking it seriously because you, cause you love the game and you don't want to just fucking, like, compare yourself to everybody else around you. Like, you don't need... You don't need the validation from other people, but you need enough attention on the game to not let it fucking die. Like, am I making any sense right now? Am I the only person who understands, like, why the hobby is just so fucking stupid now? 
it just it just feels so fucking soulless, man. That's what I bring to the table and it's not enough. I just get shit on for it. Why don't you just run Mario? You'd be so good at it with the amount of time you put into SpongeBob. I'm just fucking tired of it, man. There are already people fucking playing that game. They're doing a fantastic job. Why do they need me? They don't fucking need me. There are games that need me. What happens to those games, man? Maybe it's not as bad as I think. It really is just part of the community, man, but I'm just like, I, I'm not willing to accept that. And that's why I still fucking do it. I'm just not willing to accept it, man. I've just, I've always been a fucking clown, dude. And as soon as I start trying to, like, not present myself as a clown... It's just, like, the, 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 low, the low amount of self-respect that I have, I'm just starting to realize, like... A year ago, I was much more willing to torture myself than I am now, and I think that's a good thing. I'm just, like, I'm just growing out of it. I'm seeing the light. I see why people don't do this shit that often, man. has to be a better way for all of this like every aspect of this shit the speed running the the fucking the subathons like there has to be a better way there's no way this is like this is figured out dude like it's just, like, so crazy, man. I could talk so much shit. I'm not going to, though. Like, I just... I, it's not worth it. I just need to learn when to shut up. Just fucking... Just fucking hate all this, man. <laughs> I just want it to be better, and that's why I keep fucking trying. These, these subathons are literally just cope for me. Like, trying to to reach my number so I have a future and I don't have to fucking struggle when the streaming stuff is over someday. And still do what I want to do, what I think is the right thing to do. It's, like, not abandoning things and actually putting respectable effort into stuff that you know isn't going to get it if you're not doing it. I have to abandon everything. The day I abandon Spongebob is the day that I, I just fucking lose my soul, man. It's, I can't do it. The game is too good. It doesn't deserve it. Uh, the shift, the shift fucking Nintendroid arc, where I just accept money from Nintendroids for doing fucking stupid bullshit. It's coming. Nobody fucking shovels it out like Nintendroids, man. Just sell out. Just fucking sell out, dude. What are you waiting for? Congratulations, you won. Hey, thank you, him. Congratulations, you won. Congratulations, you won. Oh, there's Creo, I'm sorry.
I don't mean to lump everybody into this. The, the, the people who are le legit, like, not like this, I know who you are. Like, I'm, I'm very aware. The people who have been frustrated the past three weeks and are just, like, tired of all this because they see what it's doing to m not just me, but everybody else who's been contributing to the subathon. Like, I see you. I'm, I feel for you, too, man. <laughs> it's easy. It's easy to only pay attention to the person who's mic'd up. This is negatively affecting a lot more people than just me, and that's what- that's why I fucking freaked out earlier. It just hit me all at once that, like, I'm just getting trolled, and the people who actually, like, wanted this thing to be what it is are just... They're sitting here watching it unfold, like, miserable. And I'm sitting here, like, I feel it too, man. It sucks. I literally take my, like, 100 good fans over 10,000 people watching me any day. That's where I'm at with streaming, man. I've, I've done it all. I've had the fucking, like, 7,000 viewers at once. I've had the fucking, like, he's the most popular streamer for this game right now bullshit. Like, I've, I've seen it all, dude. Like, I've done everything I want to do with streaming. I just need to make ends meet. If I have a hundred viewer streams and they're all just like the people who give a shit and don't fucking boss me around, like, I'll take it. I gladly accept it, man. I'm tired of the fucking dick measuring competition. My dick is quite literally bigger than all these fucks who act like they're better than me. No, it's true, man. Half these people that I fucking butt heads with half the time have fucking small dicks, man. Some of the drama that I've gotten into over the past seven years is so fucking petty and stupid. But just leave me the fuck alone, dude. Fucking making servers for this shit, like... What has gotten into people? Yeah, they're still doing it, man. That, like, continue- the rattling continues, like... It's actually unreal. There are fucking streamers in- in these spaces with, like... Like- like, far fewer moral reservations. And- and one-sixth of the fucks to give about their viewers and the things they're creating and doing. And they get 30 times the fucking respect that I do from people who surround- Like, it's just insane at this point. That I even still fucking care. Like, I lost, man. It, too much hate. Like, I'm just tired of it. I'm just fucking sick of it already, man. It used to- It was a meritocracy, man. That's why I got into it in the first place. Like, oh shit. Here's a guy who's doing something interesting. That's what it was. It wasn't just me. Like, I made so many, like, genuine friends on the internet back when it was a meritocracy, because they're like, oh, this guy also fucking cares about what he's doing, I respect that. But, like, it hardly ever happens anymore. They never show you that shit. It's at the point where it's just weird. 
I'm not I'm not saying this as somebody who's like not looking around and not seeing things. Like the fact that like some of my own viewers make me feel bad about trying is insane. It's really gotten to the point of so why are you putting effort into this? Like why aren't you making me laugh? Like what the fuck, dude? I'm sick. I, I, I refuse to play that game, man. And because I refuse, like, it's, my numbers have only gotten worse since I refuse to play that game. I'm just tired of it. I've literally gotten the question while I'm speedrunning. Do you care about your career? Or only getting personal best? Like, I thought that was kind of the point. Like, that's why I started the stream. Like, it's just a fucking demonstration, man. And then when I'm playing the game and I'm jumping through the hoops, I'm still getting disrespect. So what do I do, man? You know why last year's subathon was refreshing? Because it really felt like a rally to, like, give me a break, you know? Like, the first, like, 50 or 60 days of that subathon, it really did feel like a rally. Like, this guy has worked so hard for us over the past six years. Like, this guy deserves a break. And it felt good. I don't know what this is, though, man. This is just weird. I don't like it. That's just, that's just a loser's mentality. You need, you need somebody poking you on the back with a stick to get you to do anything. Dude, raising kids can't be fun either. Does it have to be a competition? Please, please reconsider your logic. I just hate how everything has to be fucking validated now. Like, you can't just like do something because it's cool. I think this is cool, so I'm gonna do it. I don't care how it makes me feel. I'm gonna do it because I think it's something that's worth doing. Whatever happened to that? This is what this is what's wrong with the internet now, man. Everything needs to be justified. Everything needs to have a bat a back pad. That's all this shit is now, dude. Like, it's that's everything. Everything now. You understand what I'm saying? Nobody's fucking based anymore, man. Nobody's just based on themselves. It's always, this person is giving me this fucking, this person is dangling these keys over my head, so fuck it. Like, I guess I'll keep doing this because people want me to do it. I'm just so over it. People don't do anything because they want to do it anymore. They just do it because other people want them to do it. Or they feel expected to. That's the problem, man. Everybody's miserable. They just won't admit it. I'm trying my hardest to not be miserable, but it's hard, man. I was making jack shit from like April to June, but I was content making jack shit. I'm just saying. One day of subathon, I make more than I make in a month of streaming SpongeBob. And I still hate it. I want to enjoy it again, but... That, that is the straw that broke my back with the fucking... Beeping is so funny, dude. Let's just torture this guy. Let's just shit on everybody who's been, like, trying to keep this subathon alive. Like, there's just no respect for anybody anymore. You're not just fucking with me, man. You're fucking with everybody who's just, like, 
tired and fatigued trying to like stop the edging. It sucks, man. So many of my viewers are just like fatigued, man, and like you wonder why. It's legitimately taking me like an hour to like read this pattern because my brain is working at like fucking one tenth speed right now, man. This is why streamers go crazy, man. <laughs> Nobody could ever do it like me, though. Doing what I've been doing for as long as I've been doing it, like, you lose your fucking mind. This is why people sell out, quit, or go crazy. Those are your three options, man. Sell out, go crazy, or leave the website. That's 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 it. And you're just holding on for as long as you can until until one of those three things happen. I mean, like subathon is kind of sell out, but it's not full sell out. It's never go full sell out. I just like I don't I don't want to entertain myself, man. I just want to like do stuff. I've got a limited time to do everything that I want to do on this website, and, like, I'm not going to be able to do it. And it, just, it, it gets me up every fucking day. There's nothing more painful than wanting to do this for 18 hours a day and not being able to because I'm fucking tired. We had a good thing going the first week. I'm surprised it's gone on this long. I know. I'm just I'm just not the same person I was back when we were like playing games for fun yeah. and stuff. I tried telling this to people, man. Like it's not that I don't wanna hang out or talk anymore. I just like I just don't wanna like like do stuff like that. Like there's I just I know I'm running out of time, man. People just don't understand me anymore. It's like, it's really just sickening. Cause like, it's not even like, I can't blame people. I can't blame anybody for that, but like, I just, I'm just always gonna be alone, you know? literally what it is man like I'm not I'm not upset like I am what I am I can't I can't hate myself for who I am but like yeah it is what it is like whatever I just, all I ever wanted was to not have to justify that to people. Like, I don't care if you like, you like care, if you like it or not. Like, I just, I'm tired of having to like justify it and like fight. I feel like there's always a fight, man. I 
Like, I'm always trying to, like, prove something to myself, and... That's, like, that's, like, all that gets me up anymore, man, is just, like, trying to, like... Like, see what I can do with the day that I, that I woke up into. That's it. I just, I don't get anything from, like, entertaining myself anymore, you know? Doesn't mean I don't like you, I just, like, I just can't do it anymore. I feel like I wasted my first half of my 20s just, like, enjoying myself when, you know, I could have done so much more. I should have just dropped out of college and worked harder on the stream. Like, maybe I could have, like, knocked out everything I wanted to do with Spongebob in, like, like, seven years instead of what's gonna be, like, fucking, like, 11 or 12 years, man. There's just, like, way too much that I want to do. And I just don't have time for anything but that. I don't hate you, I just need to live my life. I just have to live my life, man. I can't I can't live a life that people tell me is like normal. I just have to do what I think I wanna do and that's it. I'm just a freak like everybody else on this fucking platform. The difference is that I'm not trying to be a clown. It's just really like, the only thing that bothers me at this yeah. point... Hey, thank you, uh, Kojo. <clears throat> well, the only thing that truly bothers me to the core at this point is that my own fans ask me when I'm gonna stop playing Spongebob. Like, that's, that's the root of the issue here for me. I know, I know that they wouldn't be asking that if I were playing something that they personally gave a shit about, they ever respected it. If they weren't just watching it because it was hype, and it was the new shiny thing. It just sucks, man. Because I'll still do it, because I want to do it, but... I was a lot happier back when everybody was on my side for it. At least my own fans, you know, that's what I mean by that. At least back in the day, like, I didn't have to, like, explain to people, my own fans, why I'm playing the game that I've been playing for seven and a half years. That's the only respect that I demand at this point. I'm not gonna tolerate it anymore, man. Yeah, it really does, man. And, you know, it's kind of sad that people act like it's just, like, the same game it was three years ago. When in reality, they're just, like, confessing that they never actually watched the gameplay. And then it makes me wonder if people ever were watching it. When you think about how few people even understood what was even happening, like nobody even knew what a cruise boost was before those history videos came out. And it's unimaginable now. Like, you can't even imagine like watching that game and like people not understanding what's going on, like the, at least the basic stuff, right? But that's how it was, like back in the day, nobody understood what was happening in that game. Nobody really ever cared. 
except for me. Big clout, big clout machine. Now, like, all you can do is just trust me that this, that used to be the fucking shit, because I accidentally nuked all my clips somehow. I don't remember doing it. It was one of those days during the second week where I wasn't sleeping, and I guess I just deleted everything, so... <laughs> all those moments are just gone, I guess. At least, like, a good portion of the best ones are preserved, but... Only on a channel that I made last year, so nobody's, like, even, like, seen those clips. They got like a few hundred views each. It's like an archive channel. That's all we have now. It's like basically just gone. Seven and a half years of clips and moments just erased entirely. Like, you don't understand, like, what I've been going through trying to just ignore that and still, like, do all this shit every day. And not, like, fucking just randomly start thinking about it. Thanks for the hundred subs, false. I'm sorry you have to deal with this shit, man. Cause I, I know yeah. that you just you just want things to go back to the way they were. Congratulations, you won. Yeah. I'm like I'm not just talking about the subathon, man. Congratulations. It's you one won. thing when you think like, oh, I want, I want things to go back to the way they were, but then you realize that they never were that you way. Won. It's just all in your head that people actually gave a shit about what you were doing. I've always had like fans who got it, you but won. I really thought it was more people than that. Like, I got gassed up by so yeah. many fucking people who actually just hated my guts for so many years. People who were close to me too, were just low key, just loathing me. You won. And fucking thousands of viewers who just, like, they were just waiting for an opportunity yeah. just to fucking take a big wet shit on me. Yeah. I wonder where they all are now. I hope they just grew up and, yeah. like, escaped this hellhole of this website. In that case, I'm happy for them. Yeah. Uh, NZ, thank you for the time gifted, man. You won. There's nothing... I just feel no purpose in life anymore, except, like, you won. secure my future and make Spongebob faster. That's all I want anymore, man. Congratulations. You won. Everything else can just, like... It's optional. Congratulations. It's, the rest of it's indulgence. Those are the only two truths to my life at this point. Congratulations, you won. And like, if you don't accept that, like, you just don't accept me. I'm not gonna try to make you, you feel won. bad, but I'm just, I'm just laying it on you 100. If you don't accept that, then you don't accept me. And you if you won. don't accept me, at least just try not to change me. Or don't try to change me. At least have the respect to not try to change me. Make me feel bad. I don't care what my fans think, man. That's it. Yeah. So it just sucks ass when I feel like people are just sitting on their knees and praying that I stop playing something that I care about that much. I don't care how much people think I've done.
you. It's not important to me. Maybe this is a life lesson, man. Congratulations, you won. You should just feel the same way. Like, you don't need somebody to fucking validate what you're doing. Congratulations, you won. You need to do what you want to do. And make it work. Yeah. Congratulations, you won. You don't need to have a reason for it, as long as it's something good. It's not something that's like bad, you know. Congratulations. Hurting people you around won. you. Know I mean? Congratulations. It doesn't you matter won. how crazy it is, because it's up to you. Man. What is the difficulty pacing in this game? Is this really the whole boss fight? Like, why does the game only get easier as it goes on? Congratulations, you won. Congratulations, you won. Congratulations, you won. Yeah, that boss at the beginning was stupid as hell. Congratulations, you won. Congratulations, you won. Congratulations, you won. Like I said, man, you got three you options on this website. Mental breakdown, sell out, or leave at some point. It's just a matter of time for everybody. That's the only way it goes here, man. Congratulations, you won. Congratulations. That's why people stop streaming. It's like this isn't what I thought it was. Congratulations, you won. Congratulations, you won. Congratulations, you won. The thing that bothers me the most is like all these fucking fantastic ideas I have that I bring to speedrunning and also to streaming in general that like I see people like taking inspiration from it. And like I know that I'm, yeah. I'm just gonna be forgotten. I'm just gonna be one of the chumps that gets forgotten and everybody else gets credit for all I've done. Oh my god, this guy's grinding this game for 12 hours a day. What the fuck? That's unheard of. Yeah. Like, Undercredited everywhere. Congratulations, you won. I just want to be comfortable doing what I want to do. And unfortunately, attention equals money on this platform. That's the only problem. Yeah. Congratulations, you won. Congratulations, you won. Oh shit. Yeah. 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 Well, some people will remember. Congratulations, you won. Congratulations, you won. Congratulations, you won. Yeah. Yeah. Congratulations, you won. Congratulations. You won. 
Congratulations, you won. Congratulations, you won. Yeah. Congratulations, you won. Yeah. I, I mean, like yeah. I said, guys, like, I'm talking about how translation, like, I'm talking about how, yeah. like, attention translates to profit, like, it's, it's hard yeah. to not conflate, like, Attention and profit when that's quite literally the job description. Yeah. You know, like that's my best. I just did this two times in a row. Congratulations, you won. I don't know if this game is more beloved than it is a cult classic. I feel like Crash is like the you least won. liked out of the three. Or four. Like yeah. Jack and Daxter is the most niche, but like. This, this series is definitely controversial. This series just feels like hard for the sake of hard. I, I get that. Like, it's still enjoyable to like die a bunch of times yeah. and like, learn from your mistakes and stuff. But like, it doesn't change the fact that the gameplay is like pretty mid, you know? Congratulations, you won. Congratulations, you won. Yeah. Congratulations, you won. Yeah, so Mario 64 came out the same year, dude. Don't give me that shit. Yeah. Cap. The appeal is definitely gaming was frustrating, and I'm not getting frustrated at it. It's like, I don't know, it's just mid. I don't get frustrated at platformers, I actually enjoy them, like, regardless of how shitty they are. Except for Mr. Bean, that shit is fucking rancid. That was just, like, dramatic frustration, yeah. I was just, like, playing it up because it's funny. Fucking Mr. Bean. Yeah. yeah, fair enough, man. You can make any game frustrate you. Welcome to that's the that's the premise of speed running. Any game can be frustrating. Yeah. <laughs> game over. Yeah. Nobody cares about what you think. I don't know who needed to say it, but I just say it because like you won. Whatever. Congratulations, you won. That's why I don't care. People waste time thinking that somebody my age cares about what they think I'm Congratulations, you won. It sucks that my income relies on people like that, though. That's my biggest annoyance, and it's yeah. exactly what I'm talking about. It's exactly what I'm talking about, man. Congratulations. Your, your you income as a streamer relies on people like that. Congratulations, you won. <laughs> You feel me? Congratulations, you won. Congratulations, you won. Congratulations, you won. That uh, doesn't work. Okay, good to know. Congratulations, you won. Yeah. Congratulations, you won. What time is it? Congratulations, you won. Congratulations, you won. Six fifteen. 
congratulations. You won. Congratulations. You won. Congratulations. You won. Congratulations. Yeah, man. I think that's really just like what happened this year is like. Congratulations. I feel like I've, I've just reached the point where no amount of money is worth my dignity. I just feel like I'm losing it every single day I put up with this nonsense. Last year I didn't feel that way, but. I think I'm just, like I said, man. I think we just play Cosmic Shake and then we go to bed. And if I come back to a stream, I'll trust that you guys aren't going to try to pull my leg if it hits zero. If it hits zero. It's going to be on tape anyway, so. I think this will be a lot more enjoyable if I'm not sleep deprived. Because that's, that's what's really bothering me, is not sleeping. I feel like I'm having my sleep stolen from me, and people are just like mocking me for it with the fucking dollar at, at fucking four seconds thing. Like. That's how I feel. What do you think is justified? Whatever, but. I don't know, man. It's okay as long as they're throwing a dollar bill at you, right? Yeah, we'll play it at 7 p.m. I don't think that any of the SpongeBob, like, I didn't realize how bad they are. I just feel like, even though I, like, I don't give a fuck about these other SpongeBob games, like, I still feel obligated to have an opinion on them because enough people on my stream watched them and played them enough. So, like,. I just wanted to do that. I wanted to have an opinion on all the SpongeBob games, give a definitive tier list so we can, you know, people can just stop asking about it, you know. And don't get me wrong, I want to finish the PS2 classics as well, but it wouldn't be the end of the world if it ends tonight. I, don't, I think that doing it this way is just going to make people who actually enjoy the stream feel more inclined to support it anyway. Because all we're doing is just like putting the ball in the court of people who just want to torture me. People who are enjoying it are hesitant to actually donate because they just feel like it's become torture and it's not fun for them anymore. Well, you see, the subathon last year didn't have a multiplier for 60 days, so that's just a bad take. It has nothing to do with the multiplier. What's the longest break you've gone on streaming? I've never taken a break of streaming. I've had to stop speedrunning before because of injuries and subathons, but thank you, Long, for the 20 minutes. I appreciate that. The multiplier caused too much drama and confusion. That's the classic clip that all the big streamers reacted to because I was trying to explain how it worked and they clipped it out of context. But I said, I'm trying to save you money because someone was going to give subs anyway if they got the subs, if they got the, the deal before the multiplier ran out, they were going to give subs anyway. So I said, if you give the subs now instead of in five seconds, you're going to save money. And they took it out of context to make me look evil for explaining how the multiplier works. So no, I'm not fucking going back to that. They could think what they want, but it does get annoying after a while when you're trying to run a subathon and you have randoms coming in your chat every three seconds complaining about how you're running it when they're not watching it anyway. 
I'm just tired of being bothered by people, man. I'm just- I want to have a small stream that doesn't get bothered by these other fucks who are fucking- Like, these- these- this- like, the main Twitch audience now just sucks. I don't want to be a part of it. I just want to have my nice little comfy, like, like, 200 to 800 viewer averages, depending on what we're doing. And that's- that's it. Like, I'm happy. That's all I want. We don't- we don't need these people, man. Like, we don't need this audience. I don't want to appeal to these crowds. It's not the same website anymore. It's a different audience than it was seven years ago. People are just out here exposing themselves, dude. There are not enough people on this website to create the kind of community that I want. If you want a community like we have here, it's not gonna be that big, man. I accepted that a while ago. I think that, like, 800 when we're doing, like, like, the first time in a while we played, like, a random game or whatever is typically how it goes. That's, like, perfect. The chat's perfect. You know, enough people are, like, seeing the stream to actually click on it. Like, we're not getting buried under the, under the directories when we're at 800-ish. 200 is pretty rough. It's hard to get followers when we have 200, but... There are levels to this man. Yeah, I'm tired of playing the game. You have to understand the feeling if you've ever like like been involved in anything long term, like you know, like the fan base of this thing that I like, or like the, the player base or whatever, is not the same as it used to be when I first started. Like I would not have gotten into Twitch if it were like this. Seven years ago, I would never have gotten into streaming. Yeah, it sucks, man. The way I do things here would have slapped in 2016. I've just been trying to iron out how I want to do it. And you know, like, is this auto target? Like, how does that keep hitting me? Yeah, man, when you- when you care so much about something, it feels like it's being taken away from you, like, slowly, you know? I wanted to care about Twitch, but, like, it's just hard, man. Is this auto to- oh, it's diagonal. Okay, I get it. Yeah, dude. That's why I keep my foothold in Spongebob, man, because if I ever leave that community, I know I'm never getting back in. It's just gonna be some tiny-ass fucking community that just hates my guts if I leave it. And I built that community. If anybody deserves to be a part of it, it's me. I'd rather be miserable with the prospect of building a nice big community surrounding my favorite game than just stop playing it because a few people are assholes who surround it. And just let the game that I care about just end up being a tiny little fucking stupid Spongebob game just like it would have been if I never touched it. Because it can be so much more, man. But it's just gonna be a fucking tiny group of people jerking each other off with, like, trolls primarily filling the chats if, if I'm not around. And they can't wait for the day that I eventually give up. Because that's what they want. They want a fucking playground where all, like, anything goes. They can just say whatever they want, do whatever they want. Act like a bunch of fucking babies. Make the game look terrible. I mean, you saw what happened in the Spongebob movie community. It literally would be the Battle for Bikini Bottom community if we weren't around. If this community didn't have a foothold in Battle for Bikini Bottom, it would be just as bad as the movie community. Whatever you think about that one. And a good portion of people in my chat who used to play that game say the same shit, man. Like, like it just sucks over there. That's what it would be, man. That's the Spongebob fan base without me in a foothold. What happened to it? 
It's just the scraps, man. It's literally it's literally what you get if we if we weren't around. And if people complain about how that community ended up, then like this is what needs to happen. Or it was all for nothing. The last thing I will fucking have is my favorite game getting run by a bunch of losers. The community getting fucking overtaken and run by a bunch of losers. I've got way more time than you do. And I care way more than you do. We were talking about Phil earlier, how like the fucking bullshit overran his community and he just left speedrunning and just like didn't look back. It's, it's flip sides of the same coin, man. These communities need sane people in charge or they just fucking destroy themselves. And some people just have the fucking, like, confidence to walk away. That's actually a really, really good way of putting it. It's like... Closed ranks... Among people who are either banned or, like, ostracized. It's just the scraps. It, it sucks, man. Like, you know that's how that shit would be in battle, if we ever stopped playing the game. People just don't like accountability. People just want to say and do whatever they want on the internet. And, and like... That's what you get. For better or worse, it's what you would get if we weren't trying to have some sort of, like, dignity attached to the game. You can bounce off of those boxes if you hold A. Yeah, but, like... That's not enough space, though, is it? I don't think it's enough space. That's happened to other games recently as well. The best streamers left them. That's what happened to the Sunshine community too. And two years, three years after that, all the all the best streamers were gone, and they had fucking massive controversy over like the new people who took their place with the server. Or I hate talking about this because like I know they probably want to put it behind them, but with all all respect given to them, they handled it better than we ever could have handled it. What happened with like half their community getting banned? Like, that's what happens when normal people, normal sane people, are pu are slowly pushed out of a community, man. And it's, like, inevitable. It's honestly a losing battle, but we just sit here and do it anyway. Like, those of us who still care. Wow, I was right at the end when I came over to I don't mind the camera angles. I just feel like this remake's movement's gotta be like not as good as the original. Like PS PS1 games kinda had that feel to them. This 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 game just doesn't have it. It just feels like unreal. What what time is it now? It's not directly speedrun related, but I remember how I felt bad when the game allowed started blowing in popularity to the point where the reputation of the game is sourced because of all the dumb people. Yeah. That was one of my things too. That was the reason why I fucking put the pedal to the metal with the history videos before Rehydrated came out. Just to like, reduce the chance of like, people who just walked into the game and begged for attention, taking over the community. Like, I needed to establish this community as, like, the definitive people who are, like, in charge and, like, popular by making those videos before the game came out.
because I really do feel like rehydrate would have been taken from us, man. It's, it's like, sad. Like, I don't want to think of a world where those history videos didn't come out. Oh, yeah, Odyssey, yeah, I know what you're talking about, man. Unfortunate. It's all, like, the speedrunning communities all get this shit, though, right? I think that most people go into speedrunning to flex their ego. Because it's an easy thing to, like, feel good about yourself without having to directly confront people and compete against them. And some people just go down the road of, like, I want to continue comparing myself to other people, and then some people just become base and just do it because they want to do it. You know? Like, you have the choice to, like, go deeper down the hole of mental illness or turn it into a good thing. And it feels like when you try to turn it into a good thing, you just get, like, treated like you're just weird for it, you know? Sucks. A lot of big egos in a hobby that's, like, really just truthfully, truthfully worthless outside of the people who play these games. I don't need people to tell me that what I'm doing is worth it. But it does hurt when, like, people who were telling me it was worth it for all those years turn around and say, this is no longer cloudy, so, like, why are you still doing it? The fact that I still got people, like, trying to fucking push the bullshit that I suck at video games, except for Spongebob. Because I only play Spongebob, which isn't even fucking true. Like, the fucking disrespect, dude. Like, catch somebody saying that in the Mario Runners chat. And literally be like, maybe it's just a game. The game's bullshit. You're a god at games, dude. It's like, so stupid, man. Just clawing for any semblance of respect. Or you could just leave me alone. I'm not asking for your praise. I just want to be left alone at this point, man. That's why I don't fucking try to get attention anymore. That's why I'm happy this subathon is more low-key. I just- I'm just sick of playing the fucking game, dude. The- the, the fucking stream game. This is the clout game. I'm just tired of it. Dude, I don't give a fuck what I'd be nice at. I don't want to be nice at one game. It's the only game I care about. It doesn't fucking matter. Nothing matters except for that game. That's it. I'll be the last man playing it. Doesn't matter. I found it. I got lucky. I, I, I appreciate every single day that I landed on that game as early as I did. This is like, there's nothing else, man. I've played them all at this point. There's nothing else but that one. We're still edging because I haven't slept yet, but you know. It's okay, because we're going to play Cosmic Shake when we finish this game, and then I'm going to go sleep. And if it's still on when I'm awake, I'm going to continue. But, like, this is, this is, like... I gotta stop just, like, disrespecting myself on my stream, man. This, I, need, I need to go to bed, regardless of what time is on that timer. Like, I just need to do it. I didn't expect this subathon to last more than a week. I didn't care if it lasted more than a week. But then the bonus games came in and we were having fun playing the PS2 classics and the SpongeBob stuff kind of got put on hold. Like the goal of finishing the franchise kind of got shoved off. I just want to get back on track. We got to do Cosmic Shade tonight. I don't think the Game Boy games need to be played, but I, I'll be happy to play them just to, like, rank them. Like I said, I want I just want to, like, people always ask me when I'm speedruns Battle for Bikini Bottom, like, have you ever played these other games that I played? And, like, yeah, like, I didn't play all these Spongebob games when I was growing up, but, like, it's just nice to have an opinion on them, you know? So I can, like, have conversations about stuff that a lot of my viewers watch, because let's face it, man, like, a lot of the BFP fan base is people who like Spongebob, like, you know, you can't really escape that. It's the same for all the games, like... <laughs> fucking Zelda fans like Zelda games, you know? You can't... Imagine, like, being, like, a streamer of, like, a Zelda game, and you can't even, like... Like, oh yeah, I didn't play all... I only played this one, you know, like... 
it's like hard to like talk to people. Yeah, my two goals for the subathon. Shit. My two main goals were to get through all the SpongeBob games and sell all the Creo cards. I'll be fully satisfied if both of those things happen. But at this point, man. I think that staying up for people who are just edging is disrespectful to myself and people who don't want me to do this to myself as well. Because the, the real fans don't want me to do this to myself. If, they're, if, they're, if we get this back on track and I'm sleeping and people are just like paying attention to the timer when I'm sleeping. enjoyable for everybody and I didn't want to say this because it breaks the immersion but there is something that plays when it hits zero we just it, it broke the night before the stream started so it's not automatic I have to physically be here to play it and I was gonna try to make it seamless but like if I'm sleeping I can't do that anymore if it dies I'll come back I'll play the clip and then it'll be over it's not going to hit as hard because people will know that it's not just happening automatically, but it's not worth my mental health anymore to try and put up that bit for 31 days. I won't rob you of seeing the clip, but it's not going to hit the same as it dies when I'm not here. That was kind of cool. This game had its moments feels like bland. Like a lot of the, the movement feels like really bland though. Just a very bare bones platformer, but you know, 1996. However, Mario 64 doesn't feel that way, so I don't know. Yeah, the people who the people who want to support the stream most want me to sleep the most, so it doesn't make sense to do this the way I'm doing it. Yeah, movement is the biggest deal. This game is like a cool like platforming challenge, but I'll, I'll honestly pass on it. It's kind of fun though. Just if it were easy, it'd be worthless. But that's my point. The only thing this game's got going for it is like the platforming challenges, like the level design. It's got great level design, but yeah, everything else is just like whatever. I mean, we gotta be nearing the end of this game at this point, right? So we might as well finish it. It's pretty short. Yeah, we might as well. We gotta finish games. That was a criticism that, like, I felt was unjustified for the first subathon was that we weren't finishing games, but I get it. Like, we should really, we should really try to finish these games, man. Just the fucking attention deficit shit. We were popping around every two hours. We finished, boy. It took forever to get voted back in, but we finished it. Bully got finished. I haven't been able to upload VODs in days, but yeah. Everybody's low-key sick of it, but they're low-key not. I, I don't want to fucking produce it anymore, man. Oh yeah, I don't give ratings to remakes. If I played the original, I'd rate that, but like... Yeah. The verdict is, I think it's decent. This first one, I like it. Ooh. 
Uh, I think it's just a full-blown remake. Yeah, some game is not entirely clear. Like with Rehydrated, it's a remake and a remaster. Like they remade the game, but they remastered the levels. This has to be like one of the final levels though, right? Like two more after this one or some shit. short game. In the middle of the game I was so fucking tired and I just couldn't even think, but in my second win now I suppose. I'm also just getting used to the game's movement system. It's like pretty clunky, it takes a while. time did I wake up? How do I even answer that question? This morning I got 55 minutes of sleep. Money. Woke up, played Wally for like 20 minutes, got 55 more minutes of sleep. Um, I, there was some, something happened in there. I ended up sleeping for two hours though, at some point. So 55, 55, two hours. A while ago, this occurred. This all went down, ending at like 10 in the morning, I think. Game over. So, like, I'm not... I don't know, like... I'm starting to get stressed out. I'm like, I'm cracking because I'm, I'm not... Like, I'm not able to keep track of how much I'm sleeping. Like, that's just like the one thing I have, is like... Like, knowing definitively how much sleep I got, but now I can't even remember day to day, which is like scary. Fuck me. Yeah, I've heard the take that, like, remasters are lazy, but, like, what do people want, man? Like, do you want the game to get, like, bastardized, or do you want the same game that looks better? Ultimately, just, like, why, like, I don't even like the way these games look when they're in HD, like, it's just, like, how do I put this? You see how, like, repetitive these environments are? Like they're, like, they're trying to, like, portray something that wasn't designed for this resolution and this level of detail. So it just looks worse, you know? Like, no matter how good it looks, it still just looks worse. Like, like, fundamentally, this game should not be portrayed in this resolution. This gameplay doesn't look good for, like, how modern the game looks. You know what I'm saying? But like, people just like the way graphics look, I guess. Oh, that sucks. Yeah, I mean, I'm all for game preservation and stuff, but like... Context matters all the time. Like, artistically, I don't like the way this these games exist, you know? This guy's always bouncing? Okay. That's such a good way of putting it, man. You're going in a straight line and there's just so much effort. Yeah. Because with the old games, it's like, you gotta look at it like you're looking at a painting. Like, why did they choose to put this there? Why did they put this texture there? Like, it's all intentional. Like, it's cool that, like, people get to re-experience these games, but, like... I think the only thing they're good for is just exposing people to the games. 
guard base reference. Yeah, no, me too, man. I guess. I prefer games with lives because it actually makes you, like, not want to die, but, you know. I guess it depends. I think for Odyssey it works better that you don't have lives, sure. Odyssey is a very different game than, like, honestly. People say that Galaxy is, like, way too different compared to the first two, but, like, I'd say that Odyssey is the weirdest one fundamentally. Odyssey plays more like Battle for Bikini Bottom and, like, Spyro. Even Spyro has lives, though. Nice because every game has lives, by the way. It's, I think it's a good design choice, you know, I think about it. It's just not for me, I guess. I feel like the game just doesn't have enough, like... I don't know how to say it. Like, Odyssey has charm, but it still feels, like, a little corporate to me. It's like, it's, I don't know how to say it. It's something about that game is just, like, a little off-putting. Well, at this point it does, but like, like... Honestly, like, that's probably why people love Sunshine, because it's the only Mario game that feels like it's not sterile. Like, in a weird way, it's like, therapeutic. Yeah, that's probably why I like it, you know? Like, it's fucked up, but there's, like, heart in it. You can, like, see, like, the passion, but, like, it's still, like, fucked up, you know? Dude, this is so boring. <laughs> it's so boring. Like, the Scarface joke is, like, like, it's not funny after, like, the first, like, two times. Not even. Yeah, I mean, that, that kind of sucked. 
I guess that, I don't know. Something about, like, Crash, like... This game probably took off because of the charm of the character, man. Like, the mascot's, like, too good. And it's hard. That's what this game had going for it. It's a great mascot, and the game is, like, difficult. Wait, are we really even close to the end here? Like, how close are we actually to the end? as well just finish it it's like close to being done so high with the What the hell was that? Oh my god. Yeah, you're right. The perspective is a little weird. Like, I'm not even going to be able to, like, think about Cosmic Shaking and critically, like, assess it like I'm this tired, dude. It doesn't make sense to play it this early. I know the subathon's gonna be here tomorrow, though, man.
Did I just break this stone? Oh, It's about time though, because at least like this game is like consistent with this gameplay. Like I like the mechanics and it's about time and all, uh, but God the, the cortex and alligator levels were so like boring. I I feel like crash in general is just like kinda of mid, I don't know. Doesn't like. Maybe I just I just haven't played the second and third ones. Or just not playing the original is like kind of tainting my. If I only played like rehydrated, I'd be like, yeah, you know, SpongeBob's like, all right. Oh God. So, like if you died in the OG, like oh, man. Yeah, man. That's unreal. Fuck off, dude. Game over. What do the boxes even do? Yeah, I don't know, I like it, but it's mid. Like, I only like it because it actually makes me, like, do shit. Like, it's not just, like, pushing me around. But all other aspects are just, like, you know, whatever. Oh, I, I see why people don't like this now. This is actually stupid. There's no way to cheese this, huh? That's fucking bullshit. What the fuck was that?
officially been a month and my mental health has never been worse. I'm not even going to bother saying it sarcastically. Dead. Really, it's the OG's easy. Interesting. That's just Unreal Engine for you. Everything's just so slippery. Why am I moving so? Like it's just like the perspective is. Was it? Was it like? Was it like that in the OG? I see what you're talking about now. It's like really fucking weird. Like I can't tell where I'm landing. The shadow is like not obvious at all. One insane trilogy. Bullshit. Okay! Like, what is that fucking hitbox, dude? What the fuck? Thank <laughs> you. 
such an unreal moment, man. Fucking Unreal Engine 4. I'm fucking nemesis, man. Just slipping and sliding off of everything. Why didn't that boost me? I held the A button. Okay. Tired, man. Chomp sitting here and playing a remake, dude. When I have a PS2, it works perfectly fine. <laughs> Not gonna lie. sleep over it, which is pretty fucking ironic coming from me. It's quite literally what I'm doing. Cool. Yeah, it's just like the movement is just so bland, like I want like more, you know, I feel like by now I'd be able to do like cooler stuff after playing for this long, but it just feels like very watered down, like I, I can't, I can't imagine the originals like that, you know. Fuck off, dude. Oh, that's when they added the slide, okay. Yeah, the slide's fun. What the hell? Oh my god, man. Slippy, slippy, slippy. Fucking Unreal Engine. What the hell was I even standing on? What? What? This fucking makes no sense, dude. Such a jank game. Feels like game jank every time, man. And now I'm just fucking throwing. I'm just, I'm so done, man. I want to go to bed. like what he meant by that comment but like whatever it's fucking crazy that people still like invoke talk about like a game that I speed ran for seven and a half years every day comparing my game playing that to, to this which is my literal first time playing the game ever are people just stupid like what's wrong with people man Yeah. 
Nice input drop. What a fucking bad game, man. I, I, I at least expect when I press a button for the thing that I wanted to do to fucking happen, man. Where is he moving? Like, why is he moving? I'm not moving. Bad to control him. Oh, good. Yay. Yeah, it's just so fucking tired, dude. It's like, oh, you've noticed that I'm not as good at a game that I've literally never played before. Whoa. But they never compare how other people are at BFB to me, right? It's just like. He's so bad at this game. And like, I played this and I'm better than him, so... I guess he's not a good at whatever the fuck. He's such a- he's so bad at platforming games because he's so bad at a game he's never played before. Like, shut up, dude. I'm so tired of hearing this shit. Why are people always trying to fucking take shots at me for my skill level in that game? Is it really that unbelievable? Like, why do I get so much shit for being good at a game? Exactly the issue I was having with like Crash 4, for example, man. I just fucking hate Unreal Engine. It's so fucking sloppy, dude. This this is an engine that they made for shooting games and like fucking storybook shit. Like The Last of Us, not fucking platformers, man. It's so trash. Like I'm not even fucking moving forward and he's slipping around shit. It's so jank. What is what is it? What engine is this, man? If this isn't Unreal, fuck me, man. There's no fucking way this isn't some derivative of Unreal Engine. It feels exactly like it, dude. So slippery, dude. It it does. It feels like fucking Unreal. It feels like exactly like Unreal, dude. I yeah. wouldn't. You would. You you would have fooled me. Thank you, Whirly. People have been saying it's Unreal the whole playthrough, dude. You had me fooled. It feels just like it. Like honestly, it looks like it too. Like what the fuck? The perspective is so fucked, dude. It looks like Unreal. The graphics, the way it feels, like it feels exactly like Unreal Engine. There's no way that that shit's not just like a derivative of, of Unreal. Like how in SpongeBob they like they customize your underwear. Like there's no way, dude. It's it's this has got to be some some form some form of that engine, dude. It feels just like it. Oh my god, I hate this shit. Man. I feel like I'm fucking ice skating on a fucking pole. That's what this level feels like. I bet it feels a lot better in the original, man. Yeah, 
Yeah, Spyro, you can definitely tell, was unreal, without a doubt. That's like, that's like, you know. It's got that slippery, unreal feel to it. Like, it just feels like it to me. Like, what's up with that? Dude, like, it, like the game engine's just, like, not good. It feels sloppy. Me saying, are you, are you saying I'm talking out of my ass or somebody in the chat? You mean I'm talking out of my ass saying this is sloppy? No, dude. Unreal is sloppy as fuck for platformers, dude. It's sloppy for platformers. I've never played, I've never played a platformer that I enjoyed on Unreal Engine. Not once. Hat and Time's literally the only one, actually. Game yeah. Over. <laughs> Hat and Time actually put effort into minimizing how the Unreal shit feels. Like, most people just, like, take the default movement and stick it in their game. That's literally why Rehydrated was a bad game. Because they didn't put any time in the movement. They just took, like, literally just, like, the default Unreal movement and stuck it in the game. Most of these platformers feel the same for that reason. <laughs> Uh, Unreal feels like shit for platformers if you don't actually add any like extra care to it. Yeah, because it's a test of what the engine's capable of doing. Like a simple task like running on a rope without slipping off, it shouldn't be this tedious. about that dude that's that's i don't know if i agree with that take that only speedrunners care about movement in games like the way a game feels to play um, i'm not speedrunning this game it's affecting my enjoyment i would never have started speedrunning bfb if it weren't for the movement in the game being so clean i wasn't even speedrunning the game when i got into it what the fuck man Oh, I didn't tell you were being sarcastic. Over. Yeah, this just feels like default movement. It's not the level, dude. It's just so slippery, and like, I can barely even like fucking walk. Like, games don't feel like this. Like, from the PS1 era, they just didn't feel like this. There's no way it took that long to turn around. And, like adjust your position. Like playing Spider-Man the other day, that shit was snappy. I really don't like when games try to like smooth stuff over like that. When like it just felt better when it looked less natural. Maybe this is actually a case where it, it does feel like that in the original, but like I have a feeling that that feels different. He's joking. Yeah, but like all modern platformers feel this way though. That's what that's what I'm talking about. Like most of these modern platformers just like boot up Unreal Engine, make some levels, and then you just jump around with the default movement. I'm not saying this game is one of those, but it feels like it. It feels like every other like like modern day platformer I've played in terms of movement.
I wish I played the original first. Because, like, I'd like to, like... Like, maybe it's actually really, really accurate to how it feels. Or maybe the original one's just, like, whack. But I, I just... I can't imagine it, dude. It just feels like that, like, that, like, slippery, slidey... And, like, games just didn't feel like that back in the day. Like, 1996 games didn't feel like that. Like, how's the ground friction in the original? Dude, that's just people with- that's just exposing your own lack of perspective. Like, do people really think that everybody who plays a game just woke up good at it? Like, you're not fooling anybody with that shit. They're just exposing themselves. You're just bad. Yeah, like, how were you when you first fucking played it? You probably don't remember because you played it when you were five years old. Like, fuck off. I don't get why people are so, like, ready, like, locked and loaded to come at me for my skills and my speed run, man. Like, is it just a lame excuse for not wanting to try it yourself? So you just want to, like, take me down a peg by insulting my casual gameplay? Are people really that lazy? Oh god, dude, what the hell was that, man? Dang, dude. I'm seeing a lot of Hollow Legendary pulls. Maybe it's the fact that nobody was getting them before, like all the boxes that, that they exist are coming out now. But still, nobody's gotten mine, dude. I think I'm doing fine for somebody who's literally fucking dying right now, but like... Yeah, I hope that it wouldn't take me this long if I were actually... Fucking not dead, you know. I don't even have a creative word for it anymore. But this game's not gonna get finished if I don't finish it now. We gotta finish games, man. Can't make it like last year. It's dead. Just don't go for it. Such tedious movement. Man. I'm just gonna do it the normal way. I wonder why I don't even dislike the slipperiness of sunshine compared to like something like this. I don't know what that is. I'm 
What? No, that's not what it is. I feel like sunshine slipperiness is like... You can double back really quickly. Like, if you catch yourself slipping in that game, you can double back, like, immediately. In this, like, you slip and then you lose control of your character. I think that's what it is. Like, in this game, you, like, slip and then you're, like, you're stuck slipping. In sunshine, like, you, you like, slip and you can, like, like, double back immediately to, like, stop yourself from falling. Oh god, is it actually like stupid slippery physics because of the rain? Oh great. Oh. Hey, Miss, thank yeah. you for the gift, man. Reminds me of fucking Attack of the Toy Bots, man. <laughs> like a dumbass platform cycle. Wait, this level isn't required? Oh, I was wondering if you can bounce off the bird, okay. And you only got one shot. Of course you do. Now we start at the beginning of the level. They actually cut a level. It's hard to believe. I get why people like this though. The level design's awesome, but like, everything else is just like passable. So slippery, dude. Like, the whole game feels like this. Not even just this level, man. What?! Are you kidding? Why would they do that? What the fuck? Did I miss a checkpoint? Okay. That's an outrageous checkpoint.
please just shoot me. Like, why do I even bother with the lives, man? Oh yeah, because it, 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 it's jank, man. Fucking jank. I think we should finish this game though, because like how many levels do we have left? Not many. That hit me. Like, what? The other one didn't. Am I just, like, done? Like, I'm just so fucking tired, man. Checked out of everything. This was the worst game we could have played on No Sleep. Like, genuinely, couldn't have been worse of an idea. I don't, I don't think there's a single. I, I think that playing Dark Souls would have been smarter than playing this on No Sleep, man. Yeah, like this is. Like, I haven't. St I still haven't gotten a straight answer. How many more levels are left? Like, are we realistically getting this done right now? Crash four is really easy. I don't know, man. Like, I'm. I can't give you a good evaluation when like I'm barely able to even recognize patterns right now. I'm so fucking tired. I'm used to streaming like this a lot, but not while I'm speedrunning and not while I'm playing actual difficult games. Like, usually we're just like playing memes when we're like this tired. Two bosses and four levels. Shit, dude. Giving me fucking brain cancer, man. I hate the movement in this game, dude. It's so sloppy. Holy shit, dude.
It's not even like more, it was like, like, terrible. It was just like bad. Are you for real? How fucking rare are they, dude? What if I got all of them? I still haven't even opened all mine. I'm starting to like this game more though, now that it's like starting to feel like more difficult and not just like tedious. I don't know how to explain it. Like I was kind of just like bored and annoyed at some parts because I felt like it was like, like the shit that I was trying to do is like way easier than it's like, like managing to be because the movement's sloppy. Like at least the level design is getting better now. this some other time then. sleep when I had it, man. I fucked up. Not mad anymore. Should we really play Cosmic Shake tonight? I don't know what to do anymore now. I think it would still be a decent idea. Because it would suck for this to end and then not be able to do that game. Because like I know people are waiting for
Why do they make it dark? Is that like a gimmick? Like it's dark so you can't see? What is the... Dark in the original. Uh, what is this? Is this the gimmick? Like you just can't see? Do the candles come back on? So like spinning the mask gives you light? Is there any way to recover this? Like... I think that we should wait until the weekend for Cosmic Shake because people are gonna miss it. I told people it would be this weekend. I think it's fair to do it now. We're gonna miss it. It doesn't feel right. Alright. I'm still sticking to my word with, like, I'm not gonna fucking torture myself. I got to replay Cosmic Shit, but. I'll, just, I'll suffer for another week just to keep things on schedule. But after we play Cosmic Shake this weekend, I'm going to start sleeping and it's up to the chat to keep it alive while I'm not awake. I guess that's fair. I'm not going to pull the rug before we play the game. I think that's justified. Yeah. Oh, Jeeble for 33 months, man. Why does this game insist on being such fucking cancer, man? I know I did. It's annoying, though. It's an annoying mechanic.
Do that time. Game over. I'm too tired. <laughs> oh, I just made a fucking enough of my ass and myself today. Fucking press the A button. Fucking sick of this game, man. We're not pausing the timer. Spongebob game left and it's like a 6 out of 10. I don't think anybody wants to see the rest of them. The rest of them are like just bad. These games, like they lose polls all day every day. None of these games can win polls, man. The Spongebob games are just, like, finished. The, the, the fatal flaw is that there wasn't enough Spongebob to, like, like call it the Spongebob, you know. This should have been, like, a two-week subathon. I'm not gonna lie. The bonus games have been awesome, but, like... I don't like the way things are going with this edging and me not sleeping. Pretty sure it's just edging, cause like, yeah. I wasn't really frustrated at the levels design. I was frustrated at the fact that you just slip off of everything in the game. Like it would, the level itself would have been more manageable if it weren't for all the slipping and sliding. What? Uh, it's just like, I'm so sick of subathons, dude. I'm so sick of them. Timers and subathons now, man. That's so milk. If it's over, it's over, dude. My, I was fucking pissed earlier because, like, clearly, 
You have this stupid like mix of like people who want it to keep going, don't want it to keep going when it's like this. What have we got? And the people who want it to keep going because it's funny to torture shift, they're just fucking doing the stupid 100 bit shit. Like, nobody was enjoying that. And I'm just, I was just fucking so fucking mad that people would do that, man. So disrespectful. This is why people don't want to fucking take it seriously, man. Like, I see the fatigue of people in this yeah. chat who were supporting the first week and wanted to keep going. Like, these past three weeks have been fucking miserable. They've had their high moments, but like, most of it's just been like fucking sloggy. It's just like, literally sitting here dying all day, man. It sucks. Thank you, J-Dog. Like, it's just so clear the intention, like, all the past few days is just to, like, keep it under a minute the whole time, just to make it continue to be And everybody's fucking annoyed by it, dude. The beep is there to get people's attention so the stream doesn't end if I pass out. Not to fucking annoy people. It's, it's like, so exhausting. Wow, he fucking sucked, and also the disc was scratched. Good riddance. I think a lot of us are burned out of the bad games, so... Like, we're pretty much just looking for the worst game possible at this point. Our games are just, like, hilariously bad, and it's just, like, a mixed bag. It's hard to know what you're gonna get. Pissing me off for like days, dude. Yeah, it did. Because I've been holding that in for fucking four weeks, man. I've been really upset with how this chat's been doing the edging stuff, and I know a lot of people who are supporting the first week feel the same way, man. It's like multi-layered frustration because like the secondhand frustration when I see somebody drop like 60 subs and the timer's at one minute just so I can get a 90 minute nap. Like I just feel so bad for them. Like the edgers just get another day to fucking edge and keep us in this hell for longer. But, like the prospects of like potentially getting a- FUCK THIS GAME MAN! Potentially getting a fucking fun game or a good playthrough. We're just, we're just all addicts, man. Like it was worth it was worth sticking it out for stuff like Negatron. Like the, the little moments make it worth it, but it's mostly just like appealing to like people who are just fucking doom watching and hate watching. Fucking disaster. The whole game is like running on ice, dude. There's no way the original feels like this. At it's just you can't fucking convince me. This is such a new game thing. This like stinky ice physics shit on every platform. This is such a fucking new game thing, dude. Oh, 
Down. I'm giving the original game the benefit of the doubt. There's just no fucking way it's this bad. Are you fucking kidding, dude? I've been this close the whole time. Yeah, I, I don't think people understand how stressful these mornings get, man. It's literally just like fucking anxiety the whole time. You feel like you're letting everybody down if like the fucking 6 a.m. crowd is just sitting here like hate watching and saying, let it end, let it end, let it end. And it's just like edging down to one second. It's awful, dude. It's like people are going to be so upset if this fucking ends right now. And it doesn't end, and then it's just like, oh my god. Game yeah, the more, the more you, like, it, it's, it's, it's fucking ice game, man. Feels like you're running on ice the whole time. Like I said, the only things I want to get out of this subathon now, like, I would be totally 100% satisfied if we finish every Spongebob game. And then we also sell the Creo cards, but I don't think that we're going to sell all the Creo cards in the amount of time that we have left. And I don't think that we're going to finish all the Spongebob games because most of them, people don't want to watch them because they're terrible, and I agree, I don't want to play them either. Like, Cosmic Shake is, like, tolerable. Yeah, if hitting one second wasn't bad enough, it hit one second again on the same day. It feels like people are just trying to have it hit one second, dude. Hit it twice. Fuck you. You guys have to be here at 5 to 6 a.m. to see how awful it is, dude. It's like an entirely different stream. And I'm, I'm sorry for taking out my frustration on the daytime crowd earlier. But it just felt like it was bleeding in, man. Like, the, the fucking early morning behavior was starting to seep into the late night. And I'm just like, dude, I can't. Like, is this how it's gonna be? A lot of people are attached to this man, and like just seeing that shit is just like gross. Like, toying with like a run- There are games that people have forced that haven't been played yet. People are waiting to see games they waited for an entire year to see on the stream and see what my opinion is on them. It's just like nasty, like, like toying with it like that just for the sake of seeing a new number. I really, really don't like that at all. Because I can sit here with like the tough dad behavior and be like, guys, I'm not doing this again for another year or maybe even two years after this because it's been so awful. But like, I still feel bad because there are a lot of people who are looking forward to seeing some games that haven't been played yet. 
And then it's just like people who have no stakes in this and don't care and they just want to see the, the numbers get lower and lower. Just fuck with the timer in the morning and just risk it all for everybody. It just makes me fucking angry, dude. It just feels like, and then like what was happening earlier, I had reason to suspect that it was just like, you know, people just can't afford it. But like, dude, the, the 100 bits trolling, like from some people I know aren't, like, they don't have to fucking do that shit, man. It's literally just trolling, and I'm like, there's no way, man. Like, this is not fair. Nobody's enjoying this. Nasty, man. Yeah, that was making a lot of people upset. Yeah, it doesn't do anything but make people nervous and frustrated. Oh. Good game. I'm not naming names, there were a bunch of people who were doing it, but it was getting really fucking frustrating. Because you're just fucking with people who are who are quite literally invested in this, man. Like, the way we're doing this this year with the Force games, like, there are games on the list that haven't been delivered yet that people want to see. And that people paid for that haven't... Like, they're not here. They only watch on the weekends, so they're waiting. Yeah, you know, I, I can't. I can't just give up because a bunch of assholes are making it stupid. Like, I have to still try, man. I, I, I can't give up. I, can't, I have to fucking, like, stay up and, like, do this the right way. Like, I, I can't just fucking toss this, like, now. When, like, some people have, like, four spoons that, like, they're not gonna be here until the weekend comes. I've literally said, like, like, please wait until the weekend to play this game. I just don't know how much longer this is gonna last, and I don't know how much longer I can take it, man. The fact that it just feels endless yeah. is just like... Thank you, bag. So. It's just like... It just fucking makes me really emotional, man. What a fucking disaster of a fucking idea subathons are. Feels like everybody's just fucking miserable and addicted to it. It's like just disgusting. I feel terrible talking about the timer being low that I have to sleep. Like I feel guilty for having human needs. It's fucking awful, man. Is that like I really do feel like the only thing standing between people fucking around with the timer is like me being here. And the way people were fucking with it this morning, just like seeing how low it goes is like so dumb, dude. And I wanna be here for the end. I just feel like it's getting robbed from me, man. Like like, my experience of being able to just, like, be here when it's over is, like, it's, like, going away. Like, at some point, it's not, it's not gonna be realistic anymore. It's gonna end when I'm sleeping. Chaos. I had to 
hold the A button, of course, but I couldn't fucking see anything because the fog, or whatever you call it. Black, we'll call it black fog, because that's basically what it is, it's just black fog. The, the goal of this game is to get you mad. So you can pick a game, I'll add it to the list, man. Getting over it is just legit stupid, though. Like, this game actually has, like, style and it's not soulless. Getting over it is, like, actually just, like... I quite literally mean this when I say it, like, getting over yeah. it is literally created just to get people mad. That's just stupid. This game at least has, like, some soul to it. But, yeah, like... I don't know, it's just it's fucking... It's Crash Bandicoot. What did you expect? Thank you, Spicy. Color hair game. Yeah. Reactions. I mean, adding a game to the list is like, we usually discuss that. I just added a bunch, maybe next week if we're still going I'll add more. Just like, right now I don't think that adding games is the right move. <laughs> I'm not convinced this is going to last much longer. I, I just dished out a fuck ton on these new games too. Like it's one thing if someone's offering to force up front, but... We, we just we just added a bunch yesterday, and things really took a turn for the worse today, man. This fog is really really awful. I can't see anything, dude. Like, what is this fucking perspective, man? I just wish that, like, I, I, it's, Twitch isn't a meritocracy, and that's just the end of the story. My thoughts can be summed up that way. My life would be so much easier if, like, the, the, my salary reflected the effort I put into my shit, man. The only time it does is when I'm doing these subathons, and it's literally just degrading torture to do it. It's, like, funny. it's not a good idea. And I've already said, like, I can't just be a fucking baby and throw this whole thing down the drain. If some losers piss me off, people who have quite literally given subs to keep this going are waiting for the weekend to watch their games because they can't watch during the week. Life sucks, man. No pattern to this. It's just fucking bullshit. What a game, man. That was just like class A, like actual fucking nonsense which just happened there.
Does, the game doesn't have to be easier, it's the quality of life fucking sucks ass. They are. That was pissing me off earlier too. The beeping and the stroke sounds all occurring while I'm like forced to sit here and play this game on like two hours of sleep. For the third day in a row. Yeah. Man. Money! I'm with you on that. Hello. Hello. Can anyone hear me? Do hear me. Yo. Over here, stupid. What we born staring at a wall? I wanted to make sure it wasn't stupid. It's stupid. It doesn't hear me. Am I stupid? Yes, you heard. I don't even know what we can do at this point to get this back on track, man. Stop yeah. everyone. one. Like after staring all the all the issues with this straight in the face, it's like I need some good jokes, man. Anybody who knows who watches me frequently. Like, they, you already know, like, how I feel about the whole, like, the FB can't be sustained full-time thing anymore. Like, you've already heard my thoughts on that, but, like... I just, like, last year, like... just felt like the attitude toward me was a lot different with these subathons. It felt like much more of a rally last year than it was a, a content milking, you know? Last year was a rally to to help shift, and this year it was like milking for content. If that makes sense. Like it is what it is. Like I'm not, I'm not commenting on whether it's a good or bad thing. It's just different. Fuck you, man. What, like we purposefully end it? We just let it hit zero? <sighs> Why do I even care? I'm not going to bed after this gets finished anyway. Even fucking caring. It'll get done when it gets done. idea how it feels to be this tired and like this under pressure and like it's it's just 
like so bad, dude. Also, just like not like usually when you're on like oh you know, just this weekend and the exam's over. You don't know when it's gonna be over, man. It could be a month. That's the whole thing is like not knowing when it's gonna be over. It's just the worst fucking feeling when you're stretching yourself thin like this. Like at least in college, it's like. Just, like you, once once the exam's over, it's done. It's never over with this shit, man. It could go on fucking for 80 days. It could go on for 50 more days. You understand that you're fucking ripping me off if you're doing that, right? Like, there's a reason why we banned that shit. You understand that? You think I'm doing this for free, out of the kindness of my heart? I have to exist, man. I'm not doing this for 10 cent subs. You want me to stream out of the kindness of my heart for 10 hours a day? You should have been here for 9 fucking months leading up to this. But you weren't. Most of you weren't. Literally fucking double the people who are you more than double the people who are usually here watching right now. I know you weren't here. When I stream out of the kindness of my heart, it's not fucking interesting. Don't give me that. I gotta be- that's a whole other dimension of this that I haven't even mentioned yet, man. Now I gotta fucking worry about getting ripped off, too. On top of everything else. Great.
stomach. Thank you, man. Congratulations. Uh, you won. Congratulations. You won. Yeah. Congratulations. You won. from the end whenever I'm stuck. I'm just having a bad day, man. So many good days in a row, man. Except that's not even true. Dude, a lot of bad days so far. Bad days are good moments that are kind of worth it, I think. I'm not doubting it's a solid remake, yeah. Asshole. It, the perspective is so fucked, I thought it was like under it, like I was like, what, is it like Mario? Dude, yeah man, I know exactly, I, I see exactly what you're saying, man, like I can hardly tell like, like the perception of where these objects are supposed to be. Like this isn't this again. The quality of life is just minimal. This is a jump that would be so easy if the camera were just positioned the right way. But like it's just made so much more difficult by just not being able to fucking see, dude.
Yeah, I didn't get to play enough of Kingdom Hearts. That was another really depressing day that we tried playing that game. That was the day that all my clips got deleted. game has perspective issues. I, I was blind to it until later. It's just like... Wow, this actually does suck. Wow.
Why is the shipping so slow this year? I'm getting kind of annoyed, man. Last year they were on point with the shipping and they haven't even been like... Has that been an issue with everybody? Video cards at least been arriving on time. Oh, I never thought about that. I guess I guess it's a supply chain issue. You're still supposed to jump on his head. I have to open my cards, man. I bet I got the fucking legendary hollow that we were looking for. It has to be mine. I, I absolutely prefer this style of game where you, you die if you get hit once, a thousand percent, but the movement's not it, the perspective is kind of rough at times, I don't know, I still like the game though.
Fuck me, man. Yeah, that's that's what I'm saying. The perspective sucks. It's hard to tell how close you are. It just feels like a lot of this game is like only hard because of the quality of life being low. At least it's Face is faithful, supposedly. That's nice. It's kind of annoying where, like, the camera makes the game harder and it's just like, whatever. It feels like you're not getting a fair shot. Him. Yeah. Funny TTS or something. Hey, Brock, thank you, man. Base.
What did he just fucking guard you? Is this fucking football? Get the fuck out of my way. My God, man.
Hey, Acorn, thanks for the 21 months, man. Like you get boxes and come back if you want to get 100%, but if not, you just go. Darn you, Crash Bandicoot! That's what I was thinking. Blair for the 10 months, man. Crash Bandicoot! Ah. Darn you, Crash Bandicoot! 
execute. Game over. Oil incoming. Whatever. Darn you, Crash Bandicoot! It's like magic, man. It just magically gets there. Mad the time it magically goes in magical oil. It's so hard to tell what like where these things are. They look like 2D sprites, man. Like the perspective is so ass. Flashing colors, it's like hard to see what's happening. Come <laughs> on. 
Sentient for the five gifts. Yeah. Time you saw this timer over three hours. Can we at least, at least agree that we can't act surprised anymore? Oh, 
It's claustrophobic. I can barely see what's happening as the fucking 2D sprites that are being shot at me look like they're all coming from the same place. Whatever, dude. Just get me out of this fucking already. Darn you, Crash Bandicoot! <laughs> Sitting for so long, my ass is just fucking aching so much. Can't even see these things, man. They blend in with the background so much. Darn you, Crash Bandicoot! Can't see them, man. They look the same as the fucking whatever the fuck that is in the background looks exactly the same. They look the same color as the fucking thing I'm running on. Time was fun. Some of the worst bosses I've ever played in a game. Like, really boring. Oh, I see. Okay. I get it. I get it. I was like, there's no way that Vicarious Visions made this by their son. Like, there's no way. Yeah, dude. Fuck that. These guys are scrubs, dude. Thank you, Vampire, for the five fifty thousand dollars. Yeah. Congratulations, you won. 
Yeah, I don't know. Like, congratulations, you won. It's like a it's like a decent platformer. I just can't get over how lame the boss fights won. were. Congratulations, you won. Congratulations, I, don't know. I had fun with it though. Like I enjoyed it. I'd probably play it again. I mean, I want to play the original, not the uh, you won. Not this one. <laughs> I want to play the original. Congratulations, you won. I just hate remakes, dude. Congratulations, you won. Remakes are just like almost always yeah. scuffed. Congratulations, you won. Congratulations, you won. Yeah. Whoa. Congratulations, you won. Congratulations. For a you remake, won. though, it seems solid. Like, it seems like a good remake. Congratulations. You know, like, they didn't just, you like, won. shove this in as, like, part of the mandatory story, but it's there for the fans. Congratulations. You won. Congratulations. You won. Yeah. Congratulations, you won. Congratulations, you won. Yeah. Congratulations, you won. Yeah. I keep hearing that this version is harder than the original as far as like completion yeah. goes. Like minus the like the save shit. Congratulations, you won. It's gotta be the movement, man. The original's gotta have better movement. That's what it has to be. Yeah. Thanks man, you have a good one. Yeah. 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 Yeah, that's fair enough. Congratulations, you won. I don't think that's necessarily a bad thing if it was designed for it though. Like Spider-Man PS4 is the same way, so it feels fine. Just get used to it. The D-pad on the DualShock is good. Yeah. Congratulations, you won. Yeah. 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 Exactly. That's that's my biggest issue. Like, they could have probably done something about that. Like, the game can still have like like 
meritable platforming, but like not be like annoying to look at. Like the final boss was just like bullshit. You couldn't even tell like where things were coming from, the perception was so bad. necessarily doing all three straight in a row, no. No, 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 that's, that's a lot of crash damage here. I've never heard the word bandicoot used outside of video games in my entire life. It's, it's from Australia so it doesn't count. doing man why did I do better the first time Thank you for yeah. 37 months. Yeah, but except Dark Souls isn't fucking bullshit. Heinous, thank you for the 20 gifted.
Congratulations. You won. Congratulations. You won. Yeah. Don't like Congratulations. You won. Holy shit, I'm so bad at fucking video you games, won. man. Fuck off, man. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you, thank you. You won. Yeah. I did way better the first time I did it, man. Congratulations. You won. Oh. Yeah. What have we got? Yeah. Congratulations, you won. Congratulations, you won. I 100% agree with you. Like, unless it's like frame perfect inputs, like all this shit can be memorized exactly. It just looks funny seeing somebody learning it. Like, when you watch somebody learn it, it looks awful, but in reality, it's easy. You just haven't done it before. Congratulations, you won. Like that dread shit where you gotta like react and hit it like on like one frame. Like that shit's definitely not like learnable. You just have to like do it, you know. But, yeah, this is just patterns. And my brain's not doing patterns very well today, that's for sure. Congratulations, you won. I don't know how I'm still sitting here playing. Congratulations, you won. Congratulations, you won. Uh, thank you for the subs, guys. Appreciate it. Congratulations, you won. <laughs> what the hell was that, dude? What? Congratulations, you won. Thanks, thank you for 20.
Congratulations, you won. Thank you. Congratulations, you won. 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 This isn't enough time to sleep. You guys know it's not enough time to sleep. You won. If, you, if, if we're doing this thing where like I I'm, I wake up before the time of the Shiro, this is not enough time to sleep. I tried doing the whole like, yeah guys, maybe some yeah. days I don't need to sleep three hours thing. All it's gotten me is just people taking advantage of that. Ever since I started sleeping 90 minutes at a time, that timer has not gone above three hours. I think it's awesome that you guys want the stream to keep going, but respectfully, this is not enough time to sleep if you expect me to only sleep for three hours. It's not okay. Congratulations, you won. I appreciate it though. It's the thought that counts. But trying to make accommodations like that and just pretending like that little of sleep is okay for me has not gotten me anywhere, and it's only made the stream worse. We need six to seven hours on that timer. Congratulations. If you want me you to won. wake up before it hits zero, that's what it needs to be. Anything lower is edging, Congratulations. You won. and I'm gonna be miserable if we're still doing this wake up before it ends thing. Congratulations, you won. Yeah. Seven. Seven minimum. Congratulations, you won. Eight is generous, seven is minimum. Congratulations. Six for a you long won. period of time causes brain damage. Like genuinely. Yeah. You shouldn't do that, that's really bad for you. Congratulations, you won. I've been getting three to four. The last subathon, I was fucked up for months, man. I don't even want to know what I'm gonna be like. Uh, like after this, I'm just gonna be dead for like a year. I wonder if it's worth it. Congratulations, you won. Congratulations, you won. Everybody's different, man. Congratulations. You won. Everybody needs different amounts of sleep. I'm fine on seven. Six short term, five short term, I'm fine short term. You but won. this is not short term. This is a long history of not sleeping for a month. Yeah. Congratulations, you won. Congratulations, you won. Congratulations, you won. Cynthia, thank you. Congratulations, you won. Congratulations, you won. Adroxus, thank you. Congratulations, you won. It's nice seeing people come together to try and get this on track again, man. Congratulations. It's you not won. like this. No, this is like the craziest subathon ever, man. This is crazier than the first one. Yeah. Literally fucking mentally collapsing on stream this time. It's just terrible. Yeah. This will go down in history as the most mentally ill subathon of all time. Congratulations. You won. Congratulations. You won. 
Gate. Thank you. Custard Gate was a was a like that really destroyed morale yeah. for a lot of people. I think. Game. Game over. Congratulations, you won. Yeah. This, this is like, I cannot describe this subathon with any other phrase than just mental illness. Congratulations, you won. This is, this is like actually just fucking with me, man. Congratulations, you won. Congratulations, you won. I'm just gonna go down in history and not Congratulations. You won. No, dude. This 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 eclipse is the last one in terms of like how fucking dumb this is. This is just nuts, man. Yeah. Hope we didn't disappoint. Congratulations, you won. At least it's interesting. Congratulations. You I'd rather just be miserable and be boring. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I got ripped off, and the worst part is yeah. it was going on for a little bit longer. Like, I didn't start to notice it until later, but it was going on for a pretty long time. Congratulations. A good you week won. and a half, I was getting ripped off. Congratulations, you won. Yeah. Everybody else in the chat who was giving subs was getting ripped off too, man. Congratulations, you won. Congratulations. You won. 30k. Yeah. I think it was more like 15 to 20k, but yeah. Congratulations. A couple weeks out, I'll not be able to get back for for the work I was doing then. Congratulations. You won. It's actually, just pitiful. That's what I get for not looking at the revenue. I don't want to look at the revenue until yeah. it's over, but I guess I have to now. Yeah. It sucks, but it is what it is. I mean, he said it himself. It, it's only an excuse. Like, does it really matter why? I don't think it really matters. Nah, he was he was like, what the hell? Last year, this year, this year, he'll be like, all right, this again. Yeah. 
here, man. It's, it's not like it's going to a different place, like, like, any time that you add is being, like, it's on the stream, you know what I mean? Like, now or later, it doesn't make a difference. Except, like, if you're just, like, if you're always at, like, one minute, you have a lot less freedom, and the stream is a lot more, like, insufferable than if you're always at, like, ten hours the same pacing, you're just, you know, proactive about it, instead of like what, letting it get all the way down. This bad at this fucking game, man. What the fuck is wrong with you, you fucking moron? Oh, good. You're so shit, dude. Fucking idiot. It's literally memorization, you fucking moron.
Oh god. What? What the fuck? so easily when I'm tired. Yeah. Most of this shit is just internal yeah. and I'm just saying it. Yeah. Thank you guys. Yeah.
What the hell is this? What? What? Oh my god, dude. It's over. What the hell was that? Do they want you to have one of the masks? Like, like what the fuck, dude? How is that fucking fair? Like, what is that? What is that, dude? except for that one part. They both close in at the same time, dude. Like, what the hell? There's no slide jumping in this game. I fucking hate this game, man. Oh my god.
There's no fucking way you're this bad at this game, man. Why does it put you all the way the fuck up here?
Son of a bitch, man. No! Good! Go your fuck them foot! This level can't be this hard! Two hours later... What the fuck? Level's crushing my balls. Looks like you need a prostate exam. Oh, great. Just... Okay, splash damage. Go oh, fuck yourself. Shit! 
You're an idiot. That's bullshit. Why can't you jump back up? Why would they even fucking put that there if you can't jump back up? That's fucking bullshit, man. That's fucking bullshit. Oh my god. Oh. Yeah. Fucking terrible. I'm not even gonna be able to get these vods up anymore, man. There's not enough time. Voting bash was fucking awful. You're an idiot. You're a fucking idiot. I, I I think it's supposed to be a rage game. Seems like that, but it has like it's not soulless. You know?
There's a checkpoint. Wait, where's the checkpoint? Where the fuck is the checkpoint? What? There was a checkpoint the whole fucking time? I, I, I'm losing my fucking mind, dude. I'm so stupid, I'm so stupid, I'm so stupid, I'm so stupid. Oh, I'm in so much fucking pain sitting here, man. What the fuck did he just get caught on, man?
It's over. I don't know how I'm gonna make that jump at the end of this level, man, without an extra life. What the fuck? What the fuck was that? Why would he jump? What the fuck? Yeah. Nothing in this game picks up, man. It's such a fucking busted ass shit game. Thank you, Shark. What's up, man?
You're a fucking idiot. You're a fucking idiot. What the fuck am I doing? Why can't I do this anymore? Why can't I fucking get this one time? One fucking time! I can't fucking do it! I don't have any lives, so it doesn't even matter. Great. What the fuck is wrong with me, man? The fuck is wrong with me? Why is this taking so fucking long? It doesn't matter anyway, I'm not fucking sleeping today. I've already accepted it.
Good job. Good fucking job. Fucking pathetic. No, what are you doing? I don't understand how we are still fucking this up, man. Whoa. Do you even give a shit? Why are you fucking sitting here doing this? You're a fucking moron! This man. Yeah, what even is this man? Like
literally perfect. Game over. Literally perfect. Well, at least I get to sleep for a nice eight hours and not worry about the timer being hitting zero when I go to bed, right? At least we know that's the case when I'm done with this fucking shit game. Ha 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 ha. I'm only doing this until the weekend. When Cosmic is done and all the Force games are done, I'm just gonna Force Unlock everything. And then it lasts as long as it lasts after that. Can't do this for the rest of my life, man. Why is that hitting me from fucking, like, come on, man! This is bullshit. This, like, why does it fucking eat my jump? Why does it fucking eat my jump like that? This game sucks, man. This game fucking made like shit.
This again. This again. Come on, man. Great. did what you guys wanted. Hope it was satisfactory. I'm sorry it took so long. It's okay. I like it, but it's got the same issue all these new platformers have. The slippery movement is really annoying, dude. I don't want to try the original game now. What time is it? Dude? Ten. I don't know anything about this game's glitches. Where's the star? Is it? I don't see it. I don't think mine was valid because I died too many times, right? really good at video games, man. Alright. I take it we've had enough Crash Bandicoot for today. Maybe. I was saying earlier that we should do Cosmic Shake tonight because I'm worried it's not going to make it to the weekend. I think I can suffer and degrade myself for the rest of the week in hopes that we can do it on Saturday. Because I, I know we have a lot of Force games that haven't been played yet. And I don't want to bum people out if I just let it die overnight. so much the exhaustion I just felt like that that 100 bits shit at the beginning of the stream was like extremely disrespectful to a lot of people including myself and just really fucking made me mad I don't think I'm in the mood to laugh at stuff right now. 
I'm just really fucking miserable right now, man. I just have no idea. Not, not a very good thing. Happy that most of you didn't have to see the beginning of this at, from 6 to 10 in the morning. It's just, it's just been a lot, man. It's just been a long day. How the fuck is this jackass not banned already? Like, how many messages do we have to delete before this guy gets banned? I'm just done, man. Just fucking ban people on site. I'm just sick of people, man. It's like, you know how hard it is to get banned and disciplined in Twitch chat? You know how fucking hard it is to actually fuck up? Like, shut the fuck up, okay? Like, for real. You know how fucking hard it is to fuck up so badly that you get your message deleted in Twitch chat? You have to be actually brain dead or trying to piss people off, and both of which you should not be allowed to talk in here. Fuck you, man. It is so fucking difficult to get a streamer on your bad side, man. It's, it's, it's so fucking hard. Seriously. Seriously, man. Should we do Fugitive Hunter tonight? I will, I will honor the commitments that I've made to only going to bed when I know the timer isn't going to be zero when I wake up and only until we play Cosmic Shake this weekend because at that point the Spongeathon is finished and however longer it lasts is up to you guys. I will be... This doesn't mean that we're just going to let it die. I'm not sandbagging the marathon. But it's going to be up to you guys to watch the stream when I'm not here. I can't do this babysitting thing 24-7 anymore, man. It wasn't like this last year. We dealt with this for maybe like two to three weeks last year. It's been the whole marathon, and it's been ten times worse. Letting it go to one second twice in one day and playing chicken under a minute with the fucking beeping with 100 bits. This is just fucking degenerate now, man. Like, like keep it up and I'm not gonna want to do one again. I'm serious, man. Like, I understand that no, not everybody, not everybody can afford to give subs and bits. That's not my issue. The fucking trolling with the beeping and making a big joke of all this when everybody's trying to keep it alive is really fucking pissing me off. Because the same people who try to fucking complain that nobody's giving subs are the ones who are making a joke of it when it's under a fucking minute all the time. And how does that make people who actually try to keep the timer how I feel? How does it make them feel?
it, you're right. I'll increase it to 200 bits. Edging is stupid, man. It's 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 really like it's trolling at this point. Like there are people who have fucking put like hundreds of subs down to have their games played at some point this week when they're here and able to watch. And like it's up to these fools who are just playing like that. Gross. The only way to stop that is by keeping it away from the fucking minute, man. Yeah, right? My frustration with, like, the amount of disrespect is, like, immeasurable. Like, you would think that with the amount of effort that we're all putting into this, people would be more respectful. Fucks me up, man. Just check for Creo cards and then I'll just. I have to get caught up on the VODs. I'm days behind on them. No Creo cards, which blows my mind, man. It's, it's so much time that gets added for them. Dude, it's flippy. It's people who have, like, thousands of bits stored up. And when it's like under a minute, just like give 100 every 10 seconds just to keep it beeping the whole time. Trust me, man. If you if you're watching the stream every single day and it's happening nonstop for hours, like you have to be here to understand. Like it's it's clearly being done to troll and like annoy people. I'm, I'm only going, like, what's going to happen, we've reached the point in the subathon, and I was thinking about doing this anyway, that when we finish the Spongebob games, we're just gonna unlock all the games on the list, and you're gonna be able to vote for whatever game you want. That's the plan. We gotta find some other way to... Like, we, we can't do it with sub count anymore because the sub count's gonna stagnate. I don't really know how else we can do it. Like, how else we can allow the chat to vote on stuff. Because then we're only unlocking games for 100 sub forces. Matter of fact, man, like... Why don't we just allow only... Like, like these, these games, honestly... The games that get unlocked rarely ever get in. Like, they never get voted for. The beeper is to help people, like, like realize it's, it's gonna end. Like, if you're not looking at the stream and you're tabbed out, that's what the beeper is for. Yeah, I don't know how we're gonna handle this.
Dude, it's so cancer, man. I feel like the only way to get people, like, to incentivize people to, uh, to like, keep the timer from edging is by having the games as 100 sub unlocks. That's, like, the only way- that's all we have, like... That's, like, the only incentive that we have that actually works. Like, that's it. So I don't think that we can afford to unlock everything if this is gonna go on any longer. Unless we are just gonna edge the whole time and I sleep through all of it. Yeah, and then, like, if, if every game's unlocked, there's gonna be f decision fatigue as well. Yeah, that's probably a bad idea. Yeah, dude, they spam the buzzer for hours and hours and hours, and I'm sitting here, like... Like, I'm fucking dying. And, like, I'm, like, this fucking, like, playing these games... Like, this is a very hard game to play for the first time ever. Like, after not sleeping for days. And the beeper is just going off the whole time, and people are just saying, let it end. And just people are just coming in here being assholes, and people in the chat are just getting frustrated because people are being assholes. Oh, T was just fucking disaster, man. Today has been a fucking disaster. It may- yeah, and that's the thing, too. I've said this before. It- it feels shitty. Like, I feel like I'm being robbed of all these experiences playing these games because I'm just thinking about this bullshit the whole time. Like, it sucks, man. I guess I wouldn't be playing them otherwise because I'd never budget time to play these games. But it just sucks. It wasn't like this at the start of the subathon. People were getting tired of it, dude. Everybody's getting fucking tired of it. It started with Slide 2. That was the first one where I'm like, here's a great game that I'm afraid to fucking put back on this stream because people are just gonna fucking beep, beep, beep the whole time. Yeah, it's- thank you, thank you, Labar. It is stressful on everybody who gives a shit about the stream. And to those who don't care, it's just funny. Yeah, it's just been a fucking cancer bad day. It's just not good, dude. And I meant everything I said earlier. For the record. But I would like to make a more fair and mature compromise to get this to the weekend. Like, to give 150% until the weekend and just only give 100% after that. Make unlocked games not a part of the subathon once unlocked and play separately at a later date? No. That, I, I can't. I've never been able to follow up on those things. Yeah, September is right around the corner. You're so right, pajamas, man. So much cancer today, dude. It, like, hurts. We put so much effort- we put- we planned this for three months. We set up every, all the rules and everything. I like memes, but like, it's just such- it's such a joke, dude. I think that this stream could handle a fucking- like, if we're just gonna- <laughs> Like, if at this point, might as well just have it a minute. A minute of sub. Just gonna fucking edge it anyway. You maybe have a few beeps when it hits one minute instead of constantly going off. No, because then people's attention huh. spans only last six seconds, so they're gonna forget that it's under a minute. Thanks, Choke. It's been nine months. The solution is don't let it stay under a minute. It's a, it's a fucking shitty situation where like people who want the stream to continue and want it to be a fun stream and aren't and aren't shit posting and want it to keep going. They're afraid to give subs because like it's like it's like being made a mockery of, you know.
Like, why, like if I'm watching a subathon, why would I give a sub if, if people are just like focused on trying to get it to like almost end, just to like get an, like a like a fucking buzz off of it? It's not fair to the people who are forcing games and like expect them to be played at some point. Like the time that you bought is the time that you bought. But yeah, a lot of people are attached to this, and it's a yearly, annual thing, supposedly. It might just be bi-yearly at this point, as in once every other year. Yeah, it sucks, man. I think that, like, the guys who, who wanted to... Lenny, thank you for all the merch purchases. I'll add that in a second. I think that, like, to the people who want this to continue smoothly, the best thing you can do is try to do more incentives for people in chat when you give subs. Like... I forgot who came up with this, but the guy who's like, I'll give three subs if uh, if I get three unique subs from individual people. Like, the only way to make this work is that there's an incentive to get people to collaborate. Because this chat will not collaborate unless there's an incentive. Like, people just want to get matched. So it's all about matching and, like, encouraging, like, new people to match. But the guy who was doing, like, I'll, do a, I'll give ten subs if, like... If 10 new people give subs, will sub, will sub goals ever come back? I hope not. Oh, fuck! Ghoulie, it's thank been you for a long three. day. It's really been a long day, man. I can- I know- I know who's- who's given the bits at, like, the last possible second to try and save it versus the people who are just doing it to be funny. Like, doing the beeping shit at 40 to 50 seconds is like... Like, you know what you're doing, man. That was the last straw, man. I was like... Am I a joke? Like, is all this f fucking effort a joke or something? Is, am I missing a joke? Am I- is, is something funny? I don't realize it. Fucking piss me off, man. Okay, unisex T, unisex T, unisex T. Nice, man. It, it's it really just like enraging. Is, did somebody bring up the fact that, like, the edging joke makes it, like, in, like funny because, like, we're memeing by doing this? Yeah. I couldn't agree more. I forgot to bring that up, but I, I definitely, like, agree that, like, making a joke out of it is contradictory. Like, it's not funny. Yeah, right? Like, timer gets down to one second, it's like a fucking awful clip. It's, like, not even fucking entertaining. Like, it's just stupid. It's overused and dead, and it's just annoying now. Yeah, it sucks. It's like we're, like, egging it on by, like, joking about it like that, yeah. Like, if, if we're gonna take the position that it's annoying, and we find it disrespectful to do that shit, then we have to, like, just, like, cut that out and come up with new jokes. Alright, Creo Purchase, thank you. Creo adds so much time, man. And like I said, I know I haven't been too clear about my goals with this. A big reason why I did it was not obviously just because of the money, but because a lot of people wanted me to do another one after last year's. But, I'll say it again. In an ideal world, my two goals that are left. Finish every Spongebob game and grade them once and for all. And sell all the Creo boxes. There are 600 Creo boxes left. It sounds like a lot, but if people start doing that instead of subs, like if the timer's not constantly in a point for danger, where buying Creo takes too much time, you'll probably see more people buying. Congratulations, you won. And it's worth so much more than the subs. Like, like a minute and 30 is like so much higher than a minute and 20. Eager, thank you, man. 
Yeah, Creo is like the ultimate bomb. Like, you get a fuck ton of time for button for getting those cards. Yeah, we have to do it on the weekend. I was just mad earlier. I just like. I'm having a hard time giving up like the moment of just being here when it hits zero, man. I can't imagine being asleep when it hits zero. And then, like, the denial that's gonna come with it because people are just, like, coping for hours until I wake up just to see that it hits zero. It's just a shitty situation, man. I don't know how to, like, like, I don't know how to maintain my self-respect and continue doing this. Like, I'm just, like, overly dependent on people keeping the timer high. Dude, we're losing all the people who are just here to enjoy these games, man. Like, we're losing our fucking audience because it's always about the timer and always about edging and always beeping and shit. Like, it's just cancer, dude. This started off so strong and just, like, fucking... Fucking edging, man, is just stupid. No, the, remove the beeping and I'll constantly be looking over to see what time it is. No, the beeping is helpful for me. You 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 remove the beeping by stop letting it. Like, do you understand how how crazy it is that people let it get under a minute this often? I've I've been saying this for weeks though. The more often people see it that low, the less impactful it is. There was a time where if it got under 50 seconds, you'd see like five different people spam subs because they were afraid it was going to end. Now we are at the point where, where nobody does anything when it hits three seconds and then 100 bits barely saves it. This happened twice today. No, we have 600 of those Creo boxes left. We got to sell all of them. It's so stupid, dude. This fucking edging thing is just like, like, actually dumb. I keep saying this, but like... Remember, it's the same community that did the last one that did this one. Same community for both subathons. The last one, everybody was afraid. They fucking pissed themselves when it went under six hours. And then it was five hours, and it was four hours, and then three hours. We're still, like... It didn't- you can't erase the fact that people just know it's not gonna end if it gets that low now. But I have to, like, work, like, unreasonably hard to keep this going when it's- when it's that low. Like, this timer right now is, like, in a really fucking shit spot for, like, my- my current physical state. Like, this is really fucking bad. But we're just chilling, right? Because, like, we know it's not gonna end for another, like, three hours, right? It is capped. It was our- it was capped from the start. But yeah, next year it'll probably be capped at 30 days. 30 days, one minute a sub. Probably. Yeah, like, we're, we're giving too much attention to it. I noticed that earlier when I stopped giving attention to the stupid edging, it, it kind of stopped. Like, it almost feels like a lot of it's just getting a reaction out of me. And, um... You, you noticed that, right? Earlier, when I stopped acknowledging it, it just kind of it kind of went away slowly. Like people stopped it, stopped doing it when I stopped acknowledging it. It's trolling, man. Like the beep the beep is there, so I don't have to say anything. But like holy shit, man! If it goes under 30 seconds, like it's it's a group effort, and and like more people should be afraid when it's that low, dude. How many people are maliciously waiting versus making last second decisions? Yeah, it's... I think the difference... The difference between malicious and making split second decisions and trying to save it is that some people were doing the beeping shit when it was like at like 50 seconds and some people were doing it when it was at 10 seconds. Like, you, you could tell when you were here. Like, when it was happening live, like... like like, what the intention was when it was happening. Yeah, 
Yes, yeah, like spamming it when it's like under a minute, yeah. The style of Subathon. No, it's the lack of clear goals. It's it's because there isn't like a clear goal to like get a certain number of subs. It's much better than the first one. The difference is that like we've already hit all these highs before. Like 27k is like nothing now because we hit 32k didn't we? It's like the next the next thing is 40k and like. We're not on pace for that this year. Yeah. We can't just like pretend that like 20k is special anymore. We already hit it. Trying to like meet and exceed the last one was like not gonna happen. Cause the goals are different this year. Like, the whole point of this wasn't to get, like, 100,000 subs. Like, people wanted to follow up, and there were a bunch of games I wanted to critique, so we just turned it into that. It's not meant to be compared to the first one. Yeah, when it's under eight hours, it fucking sucks, dude. Dude, Movie Madness by the end, people don't remember, like, how polarizing the viewership was. Like, people would only come in for playing Topless and Onward by the end. It was legit boring, but you know, movie, haha. -ha. Look at us, like, the, like it was a shit post. People liked it because it was a shit post. This, this is gonna age better. But today was just fucking. Today was the boiling point of weeks and weeks and weeks of this shit, man. Today was the boiling point. It, we could not go any lower, quite literally, man. Yeah, movie madness was fucking boring, like high key boring. And like the modcast drama and stuff last year. Like, no. This is way better this year. This is way more cleaned up. People are getting to share their games and like I'm playing all the original consoles. I feel bad about playing the remake of this game, but like it is what it is. I already had it in my library. Yeah, no disrespect to the mods, but that shit wasn't working. Well, the, t the tubby costume was something I said in passing. And it was more because people were doing tubby costume that day. Like, my goal is to sell the rest of the Creo cards and play the rest of the Spongebob games. The challenge brought people in to watch, yeah. But like, so do like games. Also, this year's been way less dramatic. There, are, there aren't a lot of like big dramas to like latch to. This has been like way more chill, with like a couple of like weird explosions here and there, like today. Exactly, dorky. And people are gonna rewatch this one way more. I forgot what I was just about to do. Yeah, sub goals. But like, what the fuck are we gonna do sub goals for? Like, what, like, what, what? I feel like the game unlock shit works pretty well, but like, I don't know what else we can do. Like, meme sub goals are like fine, but like, I don't, I don't know what to do. I'm burned of bad games as well. Yep. I'm sick of bad games, man. It's kind of just a lock whether a game is funny, bad, and still playable. Like the hunt was a was a gold mine. I think we should put the Creo on the screen, like how many boxes we have left to, s to sell.
unlocking days of the subathon. But like that's not how it works though. That's like spelling it out for people. Yeah, but like we took a year off and we brainstormed and, and like it still ended up being chaos. Like we're here right now. This whole thing was a brainstorm to try and solve the issues with the last one, and a lot of them have been solved, but like Taking advantage of the fact that I can stay up for like 36 hours at a time with only naps. Like, like holy shit, man. You guys don't understand, like, it's a month. We've reached, we've reached our, like, sub, like, the goal of this year is not to get subs, it's to, keep, like, sell the Creo boxes and shit, you know? Like, maybe we can just, like, have, a, like, different goals, like, sell 100 boxes of Creo, and when we sell those, we, like, do something. Like, sub goals aren't appealing to me anymore, I don't care about sub goals. I agree. So like every hundred Creo boxes we do something, right? Like have an, an additional incentive for like unlocking new games with Creo. So not just like the subs, like you can unlock games with Creo as well, just to make the new game unlocks even faster. I agree, heavy point, that we need bad games to like palette cleanse. Like playing BFB, everything felt shitty after that, so we needed like, like Tubby Custer was a mental reset after that. I still hate that I got ripped off for thousands and thousands of dollars, but like, whatever. Creo unlocks a game but doesn't force it. It's, that'd just be the same mechanic as the sub goal. Yeah, we have to really incentivize the Creo more. You are absolutely right. You know what would be kind of cool? I don't know if this falls into the, the realm of gambling, but like if somebody pulls like a rare card, you can like post proof of it. And we can like, like add some to the stream. Like, I don't know if we can do, like... I don't think we can add time for it. But we can do, like, like a costume or something. I don't know. It can't be tied to money, though. If it doesn't have monetary value, it's probably acceptable. I need to ask Luke how many boxes we even have left. I think that even just having the number on the screen that goes down... I think that just putting it on the screen... Cause like... It's not like, like me getting a fuck ton of subs last year was like... Doing much for anybody. It was just like an incentive cause like, we wanna help the streamer. Like, the, the goal to like rank all these games is less aimless than the variety content last year. But like, this year there's like, I just don't have any like, goal. You know? Like, I almost feel like if we had a goal to reach 100k, like, we would've... You know what I mean? We wouldn't have had any edging at all. 
Yeah, like last year it was like a race against the clock to like get all the subs in before the timer expired, or you know what I mean. Like before the subs started expiring. Yeah, a goal to sell all the cards. That's actually a good idea, because like people can unlock games like without. I think that's actually a good idea. Like if you get a legendary shift pull, you can force a game. That's actually kind of a cool idea. That's like somewhat adjacent to like monetary value, but like something, something with that. Like if you get the legendary card, you can do something on the stream. How could someone prove they actually got it? They have numbers on the back. Like, each card is unique. Like, there's like a number on the back that says like, blank out of blank, and like, once the card's accounted for, it's like, they can't like, redeem it again. The only problem is that like, a fuck ton of people have already like, gotten these cards, so we just got a shit ton of redeems immediately. I think it would just have to be for the Hollow Legends, like, if somebody pulls the Hall of Legends, something crazy happens, you know? Yeah, but what if it's just like a bullshit reward, though? Like, it's not like an... It's like an award that, like, everybody's enjoying. It's not, like, specifically benefiting the person who pulls the card. I'll uh, use the Creo command. Fair enough, but if you're gonna go down that route, their their video games have the same psychology, but not harmful. Like the psychology is the same for channel points, but there's nothing like to gain or lose. It's it's controversial because you know some countries don't actually allow the channel points because they're like they're like loosely tied to um, sub tiers. Yeah, but 130 is still broken though. Two minutes per would just be like insane. Like that'd just not even be worth it. I don't think you'd be able to do that. The hollows are like pretty obviously. I don't think people are like malicious enough to do that in this community. Like I get how in theory that'd be like something people would do, but I don't think people are like that here. I, I just think that like, the first subathon, like, there was no reason why people should have wanted me to hit 10k. People just wanted me to hit 10k. The incentive for selling the Creo cards is that if people buy all, then we can probably do another series at some point, maybe next year. That's a good incentive enough. If all the boxes get sold, then maybe later we can get a new series. Well, the thing is about the Bob the Builder dance and shit, was that those are buying us an entire extra day of content. So like, for Tubby Custard, if it hadn't been scammed, four days would have been paid for where nothing of that had to happen the whole time. So it's a give and take, unfortunately. But the base boost jump scares have gotten a lot of subs for this stream. It's 50 per streamer. So there are 50 hollow legends of mine. And I don't think that more than two of them have been found yet. Dude, I get jump scared every time because I'm sitting here focusing on these games and they just come out of nowhere. 
But yeah, I definitely want to get the exact number. The number of boxes. Probably just under the webcam where the spongeathon thing is. I don't want to put it over the gameplay. The spongeathon tag is like kind of like redundant. Like you know what this is. You know. Yeah, more more jokes. More Easter eggs and jokes. I don't know. What else is there? Yo, nice man, thank you. Oh shit. There was one box, two, and two, so we actually sold a bunch of them, holy. Dang. Yeah, I, I feel like... I don't know, I just haven't really been very vocal about my goals this time. I guess that's really what the big disconnect is. Hey, Dragon, thank you for the five gifted men. Congratulations. I guess that's the big problem, is that I haven't been vocal about my goals. Yeah. I, I like, really, really want to sell the rest of these cards, man. Like, I'm serious Congratulations. about that. Congratulations. You won. That's, like, the big goal of this subathon for me, is to sell the cards and finish as many games as possible yeah. and rank them all. I think I just added it, but I will check. Thank you. Yeah, you bought it at the same time as uh, somebody else. I already added it. Thanks, ma'am. That's why I jumped up 30 minutes. I didn't? I just, I just added three packs. Wait, what? You literally just bought it. Oh shit, you're right, you did. Wow, I'm not used to selling that many of them, holy shit. Okay. Yeah, no problem, man. I would have seen it at some point anyway, but yeah, thanks for letting me know. Oh shit. Yeah, no, I, I, that's, that's honestly my bad, like, there just haven't really been any, like, massive goals, you know, and, like, it's, it, it is kind of a massive goal to sell the rest of these, dude. Should really just treat it like that from the beginning. How many are left? I think like 600 men. Just fucking buy all of them. It's a massive incentive and it adds a shit ton of time, yeah. Yep, here's another one. Yep, just got it. 90 cards to double purchase. Oh, there was a, there was a 2x. There's the four box. Bam, bam. There we go, guys. 
Uh, I don't know. I don't want to badger as well because I know she's busy. Like, I want to respect her privacy, not just like annoy her. Hope you understand. Alright, cool. Nice. Yeah, I'm, I'm waiting for Luke to tell me how many more we got left. Uh, they're limited editions, and there are 600 left. We're trying to get rid of all of them, yeah. 600 boxes. Just like this. They come with uh, five packs, I think. I actually have a bunch of these, too. I need to see if I have this fucking Hollow Legend, man. Yeah, there's, like, no, like, visible goal. I feel that. I still, I, I still stand by everything I said earlier, but it's definitely more complex than we originally thought. Yeah, limited edition. I'm gonna rip a box right now. Cause like, I just like am shocked that we have not gotten this. They have not seen the Hollow Legend yet. All right, I got one of my own cards here. I got the common. Yeah, no, I, I totally agree that like we need like a massive goal to go after. And like we can do it, we just need like yeah. This Creo thing is like We've been trying to do it, I just haven't really been, like, upfront about it. Just kind of there. Alright, none of my own in this one. Numbers are pretty fun. Oh, I got a legendary for myself. Nice. Dude, I've gotten like four of my own legendaries. What the fuck? I just keep pulling them. I just got three legendaries in the same pack. I got I got cheese, nitro, and myself all legendary. No, I got the fit. Wait, what the fuck? I got four. I got Finberg, Cheese, and Nicro, and myself all in the same pack. That's dumb as hell. Oh god. I mean, that'd be really sick next year if we can just have, like... Like, my idea was, like, do the same kind of, like, format, but, like... Instead of having different creators, it's just, like, different years, like, different phases of the stream. So like 2016, 2017, 18, 19, 20, and so forth. I have like different stuff per year. Yeah, I got four legendaries in the same pack. <laughs> yeah, man, it's not like it was all like the worst thing ever today, but it was definitely the worst day so far, and it reached a boiling point. fucking boiling point was reached. Alright. Yeah, I... I got another one of these legendaries of my own. It was like... Shit. Whack.
The legendary hollow has only been pulled by one person in this community. That's that's the prize. That's, that's the one that we want. Creo for Creo? I don't know. I don't think so. Not that I've seen. But yeah, that. Even just like getting the normal legendary is pretty sick though, because like it's the best card. With the, the double, the double, the double middle finger. Like it's so good. Yes, I think it's on the website, but it's also on the back of the cards too, like it tells you like how many were printed total. Like if you look on the back of the legendaries, it's like X out of 500. So only 500 were printed and the number that you got is the one that you, um, the one that you got. Yeah, I'll check in a second. Thank you, yeah. I'm just trying to like get this one in the fucking plastic case. Yeah. Yeah, so like, it tells you like which which one is yours, you know? Like you get the card, and on the back of the card it says like, like this, this card for example, the one that I just got, the one that I just pulled is um, this one's numbered 350 out of 500, like it says it like uh, down here, you can't see it, but like yeah, it's down the corner. So like, that's like your card, that's like the number that you got. So like certain cards are probably gonna be more rare, you know? Like, you know, if you get like a, like the first print of the Hollow Legendary, that'd be the most valuable card, definitely. Like, num number one, the trading value of a number one Hollow Legend, like, there are only 50 of them and you got the first one is like insane. And then if we do another series after this one, those are just gonna be like even more valuable for trades. All right, the last one was at 11.32. And then we had, holy shit, we sold so many of them. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, seven of them, wow, dude. Okay, two, four, six. six. Thank you guys, it's awesome. selling so many of them yeah I agree I just need to get the number from Luke like how many are left I'll put it on the screen I got something to show you guys too so you guys know that like I have like the original prints like these are like the pilot cards more or less like they're like special they're like they got like the tag on them, like it's, th these are the originals. And like, they were given to me by the guy who, uh, who organized all this. And I've taken the time to, to autograph them, but this one is special because I got Sonny to put his paw print on it. So I'll be giving this one away at some point, at one of the events that I go, probably like Pace or something. So this is a special, I, ha I have like all of them too, like, I gave away the common at Pace earlier this year. But I still have four more that I can give away. The shift rare and legendary are both go to. They're both awesome. I love the item too. They're all they're all amazing. Like all of our cards are so inspired, man. I love the art too. But like that that's like the cool thing though is that like all these different artists collaborated on this. If we were to do our own series, it'd be so sick to have like all different artists for every year. They're all like different art styles and like different like phases of the stream. Like all eight years that we were doing this shit. You just bought two boxes? Nice. So look. I gotta wait for it to go through. I 
I'd say it's not high enough yet, and it's a little early. I think I think we can get this timer to 20 hours with this fucking Creo stuff, man. Number 1,000 day. No, they actually are sick, and the more people buy them, the more rare they get. Uh, five hours. We need 10 hours at least, man. Yeah, the shift, the shift series with like five cards each. Maybe we can like try to do like a trading card game. Yeah. Having a game attached would be cool. Put what on screen? I got I got a fucking Nitro card. You got the one with like the orange face that he has. I got number one for that. It was the hollow version number one. God pull. That's that's definitely the most valuable that I have. It was the hollow companion number one print. Yeah, that was a fire pull, man. That was the best pull. Like, that's the only card that I put aside from a different creator that was worth it. Exclusive games. You mean like, like what? There's nothing that's not on the list that I wouldn't be willing to put on it. 420, nice. Let me see if this thing refreshed yet. Yep, here it is. I got your purchase of two boxes. Oh, I mean, that's what we've been doing. We've been playing a bunch of 3D platformers. I mean, we just played this one. Yeah, like, I just want to see, like, more, like, more of the games on the list get finished. Like, I've been adding games slowly. Like, each week I've been buying games. Because everybody fucking runs Odyssey and Zelda. It's all, like, like, it's like Mario, Zelda, Minecraft, and then just the SpongeBob. <laughs> That's pretty much it, right? Like, who, who's on this thing? It's Mario, 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 Easy Speezy's Variety, Mario slash Zelda, Mario, Mario, Spongebob, Mario, Minecraft, Minecraft. Our cards killed it though, man. We had the best ones. I'm not even just saying that. Like, we actually had like the most inspired and plus the best art style. SpongeBob clears. Yeah, I like the style on Liam. It's like pretty laid back. It fits his stream pretty well. Oh, the physical and the digital were like the same time, just that um, the physical cards, they were like delayed a while because of like randomization issues and stuff. Yeah, there's so much material, dude. Dude, lasers like not even like trading cards anymore, dude. Like, I don't know what the fuck happened with those guys, but I got somebody in my DMs like asking like, hey, can you tell me a little about these guys that reached out and I want to make sure they're legit. And I started explaining the whole trading card thing and they're like, wait, trading cards? They do trading cards? Apparently they sell like, like, like avatars now or something. Like, I don't know what they're doing, but 
I don't know, it's like, it's just a fucking, like, crypto thing, man. I don't fucking know. It's so weird. Oh, we sold another box. I'll add time for that. Thank you. Just fucking sell the rest of them. They're basically NFTs, yeah. Like, the trading cards themselves were, like, trying to- They were trying to go in the direction of turning them into NFTs. Which I didn't like. Why are they creoing today? Well, like, it's more of a question of why they weren't before. We're trying to sell the rest of them. I really want to sell the rest of them. And plus, they had a lot of time. Yeah, I don't care about the sub count this year. Aren't subs going to be cheaper soon? Perhaps. But you'd have to do the math on that to see if it's actually worth the time. Yeah, person and uh, yeah, gifted subs don't get affected, yeah. Here's the deal, guys. I, I still think that the stream ends this morning. Unless we get this timer to, like... I hate to say it, but, like... 10 hours. Because it's gonna, it's gonna be 5 a.m. And if you were here this morning for OOT... <laughs> I'm just saying, man. If you're thinking about getting Creo, you might as well just do it now. 5 a.m. Was just like... Good lord. Oh, I just pulled. I can pull some more, though. Let's fucking pull some more. Yeah, I appreciate that, man. I mean, like, saving it's different than trolling. I know you weren't trolling, but, like, I appreciate the concern. It felt like during, during Crash it became trolling and I started to get angry. How many packs do I have left to open? I have, uh... Five boxes, including this one. So that's 25 packs. Oh, yeah, we can easily get to 10 hours, like, right now. We gotta start treating this like, like, the morning crowd's gonna kill it, cause they will, dude. The morning crowd is going to kill the stream. I got my own item. I almost freaked the fuck out. Did you see my face? It was a companion. But it's a hollow. I almost, I almost like gasped, I, like physically flinched. 14 as well. Dude, I almost, I thought I got it for a second. I was like, what the fuck? If it goes to the morning crowd again, it will end. I'm like, very serious about that, man. Like, if we're talking about trying to turn things around and like, have like, clear incentives, like, we have to fucking get it past the morning crowd, and the only way to do that is get into like, 10 or 11 hours, like, right now. Deadass. 
Yeah, yeah, I'll check. I've just been opening my own cards. <laughs> nah, you guys, I want you guys to have them. I just think it'd be cool to, like, be the one that pulls it, like, on stream. Okay, there were actually two, there were four boxes sold. Yes, let's go, dude. Thank you. Sound like hotcakes. Let's go. Fucking base. Yeah, now they're 15% off for the rest of the subathon. I negotiated that because my brother plays MTG and he was saying that they were too expensive, so. Ooh, I got a, I got a hollow rare. Fire. Number 94. Okay, we're pulling some good ones now. Dude, the hollow rare is so sick with like the, the waves and shit, like shining. Yeah, I got some good pulls of my own. Nice. Dude, we've sold more than that. We're getting rid of them, dude. Timer to 200 hours. Fuck custard gate. Yeah, the hollow rare. How many of these are there? 250. Dang, dude, that's freaking good. Alright, I got another Sunny. Number 1702. I got another Legendary from myself. What the fuck? Number 5. That's ha that has to be the lowest we've seen so far. This is, this is Legendary number 5. That, that has to be the lowest, man. Does anybody have one lower than five? Dang, I'm getting so lucky. I got I got legendary number five. You have four? Fuck you. <laughs> Damn it. Number four. Hey, but like five five is a meme though. Like you ever you remember the get five meme from like back in the day? I got I literally got five. I got five. That's 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 the the whole channel point thing too. It's a reference to the get five joke. I'm say I'm framing this one. Yeah, that's awesome. The Hollow Rare is sick, though. I just I just want to see what the Hollow Legendary looks like, dude. I need to see what it looks like. Yeah. Movie poop. Thanks for this three months, Oni. Chances of getting a hollow, you're guaranteed two. Every pack you get, you're guaranteed two of them. Just a matter of uh, which ones you get. Crypto. Yeah, it's sick. I love that you're guaranteed two per pack.
Goofy Goober token crypto coins in a rug of one. Let the movie madness begin. <laughs> the shift crypto rug pull. Shift better. Bob, thank you for the 36. Yeah, I just opened two boxes of them and I got some good pulls, so I'm pretty happy with that for today. Thanks, guys. Yeah, no new purchases, but we're at six, six hours so far, though. Good. Yeah, we gotta just like hype up the cards more. You just bought four boxes. Shit. That's an hour. That's an hour. Four boxes as a fucking hour, dude. That's nuts. Yep, there it is. Oh wait, it's 30 minutes, my bad. Yeah, two boxes is 15 minutes, so it's tap an hour. That's a lot though, dude. It's a lot of time. You guys want new games for the Twitch Play segment? Put the legendary on the layout. kind of hard to verify Creo for Creo because like they're anonymous when I see them. I just see that somebody bought them. Like I get an email. Oh yeah. And it's day 32 now. Happy month guys. Forgot to update that. Yeah, what are we gonna do now? At this rate, the stream ends at 6.42 in the morning. So we gotta like, get more Creo out of here and play more games. Yeah, it's gonna be OOT edging again. Nah, I don't need anything, I'm good. I just wanna continue streaming. quite tired but like I'm gonna power through it just like hoping there's there's no way we're finishing OT tonight um, we're like we're inside of Jabu Jabu
sub war. I think that we should sell the Creo cards. Creo war. We already did lights camera pass though. I, I would I would totally go to bed if we were at like 10 hours. We're only a few hours away from that. I just feel like sub wars are non-based right now, man. Like, what's the point when we have Creo cards? Thank yeah. you, Joey. Like, seriously, what's the point? What if we just smoke the whole fucking batch and sell them out in a week? That'd be awesome. Twenty Creo gets us to ten hours. Uh, probably around six hundred. I'm trying to get an answer from Luke right now. Probably not gonna respond tonight though. We can do movie no left. Yeah, no, the Creo is awesome. Chat's gotta help a lot too, because like a lot of the time when I say a lot of shit, it like falls on deaf ears. But if the chat's talking about how cool they are, you know. Oh, I was saying movie no laugh challenge. People have to like give, you know, text to speech, but like I'm gonna be honest, man, I'm tired of shit. I just wanted to like sell more Creo cards and sleep. We can play something, sure. What else is left to play? It's forced. I think that we actually got through all the forced games. Yeah, we did. What about BFPB GBA? We can probably finish that tonight. Oh yeah, Fugitive Hunter was tonight. So I guess we're doing Fugitive Hunter tonight. I'm just worried that like... Well... What do you think the odds are that we lose the stream if we wake up at 6 a.m.? Like, like how, how bad of an idea does that sound? I think that if we can get this to like, if we can get like this timer to eight hours, I think that we might be okay.
Yeah, I think that's like the, the best thing we can do. Is push 10 hours. Sell more Creo cards, push 10 hours. Get the VODs up, get the clips up. I haven't uploaded clips in four days, man. We gotta do something, you know? And then we sleep. <laughs> yeah, somebody paid channel points to change the name. box of Creo cards. Creo war. We need to eat. I can wait. Alright. I'm ripping another one. I've gotten lucky tonight so far. Alright, I got another one of mine. Just a common though. Yeah, if you if you get the Creo cards, let me know in chat. It's an email thing, I have to like add them manually. I think that's an issue with certain browsers. Like you gotta like use a different browser maybe. Getting a lot of my own cards in these boxes. I just got a hollow rare. Such a good looking card. I just got my own rare, okay. 160, not bad. I just got two of my own rares in the same pack. Okay. Dang, dude. I gotta, like, trade you guys. Oh, you redeemed the point change? What do you call it? Sponge points. Okay. Tubby Custard is fucking cursed now, man. Oh, he he changed the name to Buy Creo. Is that is that what he did? I got, I got Spatula 364, dude, Spatula 365 would have been heat, fuck. I got another Hollow Sunny as well. Big McDankies from McSpanky. Jupiter, thank you for buying this shift cap. Okay. Um, I will change that. Spatula 75, yeah, true.
Got another special. Yeah, this is a pretty weak box. I'm not gonna lie. We're going for 10 hours. We gotta get 10 hours. The edgers in the morning are gonna kill the marathon. Like, it will, it will die, man. I swear on it. If we don't get this to 10 hours, the marathon dies in the morning. Yeah, it's a pretty cool remake. My mind was melted a while ago. I'm sleeping my cards. Four packs of Creo cards. Okay, one second, refreshing. There it is. Thank you, sir. Seven hours, guys, we can do it. Fuck edging. Fuck edging. I'm ripping another box. Yeah, man, we're fucking trying to get away from the edging now, though. We're trying to sell the Creo cards. Alright, I got another one of my own legendaries. I got the 365. I got 365. Dude, I, I pulled so many of my own legendaries. I feel terrible. Yeah, all the beeping, I, I feel you, dude. Yeah, exactly, everybody's gonna have them. Dang, I'm kind of getting unlucky now. I had some good pulls though. Yeah, we we upped the minimum to um, 200 bits after this morning. <laughs> 